Hi, Vasa. How are you guys doing? We are playing uh, two, hopefully, different horror games. Uh, first one's called High World Loophole. Uh, also, I can move around. It is a game about a haunted German hospital with 98% positive reviews on Steam. So it should be an awesome adventure. It's probably like almost the entire stream because it's like three hours long. And then the second game is called Year Walk, which I've have recently had a lot of people recommend to me because it is also a Scandinavian folklore horror game. I think it's Swedish folklore. Um, and I recently played Bramble, which is an amazing game about Scandinavian folklore. I think this one's very different though, but it's it's like an hour long and it's it, apparently really fun. So I, I love Scandinavian folklore because it's some of the craziest shit. It's like very similar to like Germanic folklore, but <laughs> it's like fucking the wackiness and the wildness is turned up to like a hundred. So you have no idea what the fuck is going on at any point, which is just a lot of fun to play. It's, it's very good for horror games. <laughs> it perfectly fits, but anyway. We're gonna check out Highbold Loophole first. Uh, should be a great time. Let's go say hi, YouTube. Gonna move chat. I think we're in the right spot. We're all on the on the left of the screen, huddled, huddled together. Anyway, let's go say hi. <clears throat> Here we go. Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome to the Highwald Loophole. This is a horror game about a German hospital, a haunted German hospital, which sounds right up our alley. Now, I've also heard this is an extremely good game from many people, including the Steam reviews, which are 98% positive. So this should be an awesome horror adventure, and I hope you join me. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. But let's not waste any more time. Let's hop into the game. Let's go. Alrighty. Oh god. Oh god, that's way too loud. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna keep it at 30. Probably gonna be quiet now. Anyway, let's do it. A little loud. That's too quiet. Keep it at that. New game. Guided mode. The game lets you know when you've missed something. This is recommended. Sure. Oh, hi there. Now, lastly, I'd like to say one more thing. Remember that this is the beginning of a new era. A new era of medical research starting right here in the Highwald Clinicum. And thus I set myself one golden rule. And it is a rule you should all heed as well. What is this voice? No one dies at Highwald. <laughs> I feel like that's a bit of an unrealistic... Uh... We must always provide a better or at the very least a different option. Um... No one dies at Highwald. Hi there. Um, okay. <laughs> what are you gonna do with the people that do die at Highwald then? I mean, I don't think there is a hospital out there that has hasn't had anyone die in it. I mean, maybe like a dentist, I guess. So it's not really a hospital. Anyway, or maybe... Oh, what the fuck is going on? Excuse me? They have no morgue. <laughs> no one dies here. Oh. Hi. Um, how could it be haunted if there's no dead people? That doesn't make any sense. Also, I'm going to turn this off immediately. Head bob. Um... Where am I? Did I just fall through? Might be of note. What might be of note? There's a massive hole in the ceiling. You don't say. Strange how it collapsed exactly in this spot. Okay. The door open. It's locked. Never mind then. The door over here as well. Open. That one does open. Hi there. Where are we? What kind of part of the hospital is this? This looks like the basement area. Corrupted Sloth Queen. Thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you. This does look like a basement. We do have light, though. Um, I don't know where this is going. Do I work here? Am I just a visitor? Am I dead? I wonder what they're storing here. Probably. I mean, you could just check open, check one of these boxes, open them. This is the other side of the same room we started in. I think. Hi there. What the fuck? Well, what are you doing here? This area is absolutely off limits, especially for the likes of you. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, is everything all right? You look so pale. Yeah, sweating like crazy too. Tell you what, follow me to my office. I'll see what I can do for you. That's the weirdest, like, the Sims audio. Ah! 
What the fuck? Where are you going? Excuse me, what in the actual frick is going on? What the hell? <laughs> Where are you going? Help! Help! Excuse me, what, wasn't I gonna follow him? Sir, chill out, man. Are you okay? Oh, can I run past him? I'm running past him. Where ah! Just come back here now. What the fuck? Come back here this is insane. <laughs> Get out of here. Run. Oh, there's people there, though. This is genuinely unsettling. What the fuck? This guy's a demon. I can't leave. I can loop him, though. Look the way he moves. What, what the fuck is that painting? I can't read any of this. I'm just running. Syringe, empty syringes. Syringe. There must be an unused one somewhere. What the fuck? <laughs> Excuse me. Do I have an inventory? I picked something up. An unused syringe. Yes, I know. Okay, be sneaky now. All right, I'm crouching. I see lots of syringes on the ground. Um, yeah, I have no idea what I got myself into. I hear him walking. Can't hear me, right? Oh, God. No, no, no. No, Mr. Randolph. Looks like my way out. I'm doing it. Ah! Dr. Randolph was quite concerned about your behavior. You appeared paranoid and actively tried avoiding his aid. He plans on accommodating you in the prison temporarily. Excuse me. Holy fuck. <laughs> what? There's a prison in this hospital? What do you mean? Is that normal? That feels like abnormal stuff. I don't think there's many hospitals out there that have a prison. I feel like there's many prisons out there that have a hospital, but not the other way around. Um, what? I can just escape though? Is there anyone else in here? What is happening in here? Take document. Highwald Clinicum says goodbye to Friedrich Erlenmeyer. An article about the old chief doctor resigning. Um, I'm concerned and confused. This is a good start, though. <laughs> this is successfully already unsettling. All right, we can't go in any of these doors. Open the door. Irisa, thank you for the 11, and Bob Babie, thank you for the 5. Um, this looks like the freaking door leading into Enerlando, excuse me. What? Oh, uh, I thought I was free to walk. What the hell is this thing? I think I'm going into a wormhole. What in the frick? Select the location to loop to. Items of knowledge, one out of nine. Hey, this, um, this is the name of the game. High world loophole. Am I falling back into the basement? This is an interesting concept. We are loopers. We are, we are professional loopers. Okay, I see. Now we're back here. We need to unlock more locations. Do I have my inventory still? I don't know how to open. I don't know how to check my inventory. What is this? Um, is that guy gonna be there again? Hello, oh. sir. Wonder what, yeah, that you said that last time too. And then is this guy here? Fuck! Run past. Where are you going? No! Oh no, not again. Leave me alone. Okay, we haven't been in here. Crouch underneath. Can't find me. He doesn't know. Jolene, thank you for the 12. Oh, God. Okay, there's nothing in here. Where is he? Ah! Where no! No, no, no. No, 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 no. Can he open doors? He can't open doors. Fuck. Uh, I'm stuck. I'm in a dead end. Okay. Wait, I've been here. I think this is this is the only way out every time but then i'm gonna get captured right if i take the elevator he's gonna get me i'm supposed to find stuff oh god fuck 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 
Wait, doesn't he? Does he actually kill me? Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'll follow you this time. <laughs> Sorry, I'm concerned by your... Where are you going? Alright, I'll follow him this time. <laughs> Let's see. Not running away. I'm being a good boy. How far are we from your officer? Also, the chair's clipping into the cou uh, couch. To the desk. Can you walk a little faster? You were running way faster before when you were chasing me. What is going on? I have no clue. Oh, I saw someone run that way. I don't know if you saw that. All right, here. You've made it through your office. Now what? Now what are you going to do with me? Here we are. Don't have a seat, please. Don't have a seat, please. Let's make it quick. You seem quite lost. I don't even know you, you to be frank. I've never seen you on this station. Dot, dot, dot. So there's only one thing I can do for you. Uh, probably kill me. What the fuck? Jesus Christ. After running into Mr. Randolph, he offers to help you out. Although his suggested treatment is not quite what you imagined. He wants to remove your liver, obviously. Holy fuck. <laughs> oh God, help. The Howell Clinicum welcomes Joseph Randolph. He has to take the role of chief doctor. Apparently there were a lot of applicants. How did he manage to get the job? I wonder. Maybe he, he cut someone's liver. He threatened them. Um, can I get up? I can get up. Okay, we have found a new area. This is good. Ooh, I can crouch. I can go through the vents. We can be sus. Is there another way to go? We cannot go out this way. All right, well, let's leave before he comes back. I don't have a flashlight. He was actually awesome. This <laughs> is very, very wild and wacky. <laughs> Yeah, no alcohol for me without a liver. Uh, I can't go through there. I hear uh, I hear a page, I think. I think these are the documents making this noise. Uh, never mind, it's a loophole. Do I want to go in there, though? Can't really go anywhere else. Interesting. Sure. What's this going to do? Now, I have, do I have two locations? I have items of knowledge, too, but I still can only loop to Randolph's office. Okay. I've, ne I've never played anything like this. Okay. So, we know that Joseph is the new, uh, like, director of the, of the hospital. We know he's evil and he wants to cut our liver and we shouldn't follow him. We also know that going to the elevator, uh will get us killed, so we have to find a new location. Wonder... Yes, you already said this. Is she still gonna be here? Can I, like, avoid this? Can I climb out the window? I don't think I can avoid... Go oh, this way. Wait, what's this? Aha! Uh -huh. Aha! Uh -huh. What is this? A bunch of empty syringes. Maybe they're unused... They are... There are unused ones around. This could be useful. Okay! I need to find the one syringe from before while being chased by this fucko. Run. Where are you going? I'm going away. Get away from me. Wait, he doesn't actually kill me though, right? If I just run away from him, he's not actually going to do anything. Oh God, don't go into his office. Where are you going? You suck a dick. In here, right? Here was a syringe? Yes. Take anesthetics. An unused syringe. Now I get to stab you with that. Take this. What have you done? Aha. Uh -huh. Let's go, dude. Teabag him. <laughs> Let's go. All right. This is cool. So you have to... You're basically like looping through same areas, but you have to learn how to avoid deaths. Maybe that's how people did... What is this? Is that the developer? Um, maybe that's how they made it so no one would die. Because when they died, they would loop back around to experience their own death again. 
for forever. <laughs> Maybe. Anyway, uh, we got a green key card. What is this? Might be of note. Seems to be mostly junk. At least from what I can tell. Okay. Well, that was not of note at all then. Some confidential documents. Uh, should we go to the elevator now? Where the hell was that again? I completely forgot. This is his office. Uh, I feel like it was this way. Oh yeah, through this big door over here. Can we now actually go this way? Or is he gonna... Wait. Is this locked before? I don't think it was. He's just laying on the floor. Maybe through here. Oh, these were both like closed rooms. Oh, no, never mind. Aha. He shouldn't be able to get me now. It looks like my way out. Aha. Uh -huh. I made it. Leave the area, question mark. While scouring through the office, a storage... Office's storage room, you discover some leftover anesthetics. You don't care if they're expired. All you want is to get rid of Dr. Randolph and whatever sick treatment he has in mind for you. Thus, you manage to escape into the sick ward. Let's go. Next area. We've done it. It only took us like three loops. The sick ward. Oh. I feel like I feel like we're not uh, not safe yet. <laughs> okay, here we go. I won't go back. I won't clinicum. That's probably the German word for clinic. I were, if I were to guess. Use my absolute massive brain to translate that. <laughs> um, hello? Is anyone here? I'm. This sure looks inviting. It kind of stinks here. Let's not linger here for too long. And hear the flies. Um. So many things to see. What the fuck? Please tell me there won't be any hiding spots that I have to hide in. As soon as they give you hiding spots, you know shit's about to go down. Oh, what the fuck? Excuse me, I'm in a bit of a pickle. The fucking shitter is clogged again, and I've made a big of, bit of a mess. What the fuck? <laughs> Could you give me a head? I'm not gonna wipe your ass, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? Excuse me, the shitter is clogged. Hello, might be of note. None of these patients seems to be responsive. Well, that guy seems to be very responsive. Did the staff just heavily sedate them and then leave? What the fuck? <laughs> Excuse me. Everyone seems a bit crazy in here. Uh, I'll try to help you, though. Oh, God. Oh, my God! Oh, I just remember that you probably won't clean this up. Although I could really use a glass of water right about now. Being stuck on the shitter made me quite thirsty. Would you mind fetching me one? Otherwise I'll have to call nurse Heidel Trout. Are you gonna follow me around? Don't follow me! No! Fuck. Hi. It's so filthy in here. Alright, follow me. I'm just walking over him. The fucking shitter is clogged. I'm walking over him to get past. Okay. Uh, there's more patients. That doesn't sound right. He must be on some kind of drug. Come on, hurry up. I'm sorry. Break is only temporary. <laughs> what the fuck? I need to get water before he kills me. What's this? That's what I'm asking. Looks like a plug. And it's glued shut. What is going on? I have no idea. Oh, what's this? Crowbar? It can't be a horror game if you don't get a crowbar. It's required. Where is the doctor? Sounds like these patients really need help. Am I still being followed? Sir, did you die? Can I get... Wait, hello? Where did he go? He left? He's, just, he's gone? He disappeared. The crawly boy. Why is he crawling, by the way? Did he shit so hard he can't walk no more? Um. 
don't know where to use this crowbar. I don't remember any door being locked. I feel like I could just... Oh, maybe this at the back here? What the fuck? This game is insane! Help! Uh-oh. What the fuck? Ah! Lady, no! Lady, no! Run. What the fuck? She came from this room? She came from this room. What was she doing in here? Open the door. Use the crowbar. Yes. Uh, Gilbert? Why is this boarded off? Requires yellow key card. Oh, no. Oh, God. It's locked. I need to get something to get rid of this lady. The reception. Shouldn't this be occupied at all times? No one here gives a damn about their job, do they? What the fuck? Yeah, maybe I could smack her with a crowbar. I don't know. I'm gonna smack her. Hello? I'm gonna get smacked! Smacked! I can't smack you. Okay, she, she ignored me. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, we need to find something else. Maybe more anesthetics? I snuck up on her and I can't- Unless I just have to be caught. Sure, what's the worst that could happen? Hi, lady. Wait, there's something underneath there. Wait, whoa, 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 never mind. What the fuck? There's something underneath here, right? It looked like it. Okay, never mind. Well, all right, here we go, lady. You get your... Hello? Oh, God. Idle Trout takes good care of her patient. At least she likes to say so. But seeing you run around her ward with an unwieldy and dangerous crowbar was too much. She deems electric shock therapy a reasonable treatment. Well, fuck me, I guess. <laughs> oh, no! <gasps> Wait, we're going here now? We're going to the electroshock ward? <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh, I'm not a fan. Uh oh, war tongue? Isn't is that a warning in German? What's this? War tongue. First maintenance. I think it has a volt. Wait, it has a voltage warning as well. What kind of ward is this now? War tongue is maintenance. What the fuck? Ah, oh, good day. I'm Nurse Anne, but you may call me Anne. You're here for your electroshock therapy, I presume? Of course you are. Please have a seat. Just another moment. I'll be with you shortly. He was fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> what is happening? I'm running to the maintenance. Get away from her. Oh no, I can't go in there. God damn it. Um, looks like a bad place. Can't use any of these. Am I just gonna have to wait here until she comes back? Oh no. Oh no, she's coming. Oh, how do you know? How do you know? How do you know I was here? What the fuck? Hello again. I've prepared the session for you. Please follow me to the treatment room. What did she just say? She said something in German. Come back. What the hell? She's crazy. I'm back now in German, I see. The German people are fucked up. <laughs> Alright, please have a seat and we will start the procedure. Oh no. Excellent. Let's get going then. Uh oh. Ready? Oh god. 
I'm dead. It's all over. <laughs> the last thing you see is Anne's twisted, grinning face staring right at you as she pumps high voltage through your entire body. Is this the end? You kind of wish it was, but alas, there is more. Oh, no. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, wait. We're back? Is this a continuation or I, I get back to the sick ward? What the fuck? I'm still alive, it helped me? Electroshock therapy works? New evidence just in? What the hell? Oh, there's another note? A research paper published by Joseph Randolph. Benefits of the surgical removal of the uh, le leaker? Yiker? Eaker? I don't really understand what he's talking about in this paper. But he is making it sound like it's the next big thing. That probably is a liver. Here we go. Oh, we have new places to go. Excuse me. We have three places to loop through. Oh my god. Okay, uh, let's see. We don't have any items, right? We have three knowledge, sick ward, electroshock ward. Let's go to the sick ward. Although we do want, let's go to the electroshock ward and try to get the yellow key card so that we can escape from the sick ward. I think that might be it. Although it is telling me to go here. Let's go to Randolph's office because we do know more about him. Maybe something else will happen now. I don't know. Yeah, it's it like a weird way of i mean it's not fast travel it's like looping in time it's like time loophole shenanigans is he gonna be here again or is he gonna be like fuck you you hit me last time you are still here what are you doing here yeah i'm not i don't care where are you going yeah whatever i i'm gonna knock you out again it's like uh, Shadows of Doubt over here. Just knocking them out all the time. Wait, I think I'm going the wrong way. No, this is the right way. Uh, this one. Time to get killed. Okay, so you keep the key card. Interesting. So you don't need to. So you you can take stuff between different time loops, obviously. Okay. So we didn't have to pick that up again. I I don't actually think there's anything here. Just oh yeah, this is the wrong way. Uh, I just wanted to check it out. We need to figure out a way to to knock out the nurse, so we can get her key card because she probably has the yellow key card. What's this? It's locked. That's what it is. Get stabbed. Yeah, I don't think this actually led anywhere. Anyway. Meem. I think we're going to the... Let's do... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do the... Electroshock therapy first. Because we didn't see anything that would allow us to... Oh, can I not loop from here? Oh, I have to, I have to find a looper again before I can loop uh, forward. Um, we have to... We just have to get knocked out. Doesn't she send us to the electroshock ward? Wait, can I open this? Nah, that doesn't look. Uh, I mean, if we don't pick up the crowbar, maybe she'll be fine. Because she, she said that she was angry because I picked up the crowbar, right? What if we don't pick up the crowbar? That's, oh, God. <laughs> He's still having a pickle, huh? The fucking shitter is clogged again and I've made a bit of a mess. <laughs> I will not wipe your ass, nor will I help you. Wait, what if we give him water somehow? Okay, let's see. So here we need a yellow key card, and it's also boarded off. Um can we go this way? We cannot go this way. Okay, so. Hmm. Where was she? She came from this door. Hi there. Yeah, I don't think there's a glass of water anywhere else as well. Because if we could help him out, uh, give him the water, that might change things as well. I think we're just gonna get grab the crowbar and then get killed by this lady. And then do something in the electroshock ward. Here we go. 
give him the crowbar why would he care about the crowbar maybe we can unclog the toilet with the crowbar i doubt it though she comes <laughs> immediately smacked <laughs> all right anyway let's actually check out this the electroshock ward sweet wrath thank you for the night yes i want to check out the electroshock ward there's got to be a way to get the yellow key card here so we can uh continue in the sick ward okay um so she comes through this door i can't open that door is there any other way to go what if we just refuse to sit on the chair right it does seem kind of evil though i think we wait for her to come over here and then we go through lady hello let's just take time i'm waiting crowbar something yeah we don't have i mean maybe we have the crowbar but i can't unlock anything i'm guessing you can only do boarded up things with the crowbar okay i can't just open any door with the crowbar hey can you come over here how long does this take lady you're slow i can hit the outside and jump in this game um i feel like i'm doing something wrong read oh i have to read this i see I have to read the the text that she shows up. Yes. What kind of ward is this now? Oh, here she comes. Yes, there we go. <laughs> Lady. Ah, uh, good day. I'm Nor Sam, but you may call me in. <laughs> no! Oh God! What the fuck is this place? What the hell? Uh, oh! Maintenance key, uh-huh. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Now we can open the door, the, the, the maintenance sign. Bye-bye. I'm being a good boy. Don't worry about me. And then we turn off the electrotherapy thingy? Maybe? This is the most nonsensical layout for a hospital I've ever seen. Here we go. Shut down. So now she can't electrocute me. Uh, do I have to turn one of these on? The music is very ominous. We go here. Um. Oh, we probably need a key card for this. Yellow key card. Okay, so we need to figure out how to get the yellow key card. Maybe now the lady will... She can't do anything. She doesn't have any power. So maybe now we just... We go to the lady. She's gonna be like, How about you follow me to electroshock therapy? And I'm gonna be like, Sure, smiley face. You can kick. Let's, let's try it. The music makes me think that... It must be coming back any second now. <laughs> Here we go. There she comes. Hello. Hello again. I prepared the session for you. Please follow me to the treatment room. I hope it successfully turned off. Bam. Oh, this is the same place. Wait a minute. We finished. Wait, but we turned both of these off. All right, please have a seat and we will start the procedure. Shouldn't work now. Let's try. Excellent. Let's get going then. I turn it off. Mm hmm. Something seems to be wrong with the generators. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to check this. Just wait here. Uh oh. Um, I'm, I'm gonna get up. Can I not get up? Help! I can't get up! Oh, they're here. What the hell just happened? I should check on her. Oh, did she get electrocuted? Oh, when she tried to touch this, she got electrocuted. And she got the yellow key card. Let's go. And she get me through the security gate in the sick ward. Get teabag. I don't know how. I mean, I guess she had was holding like these weird 
daticky thingies. Wasn't there another door we could go through here as well? With the yellow key card? Yeah, this one. Uh, this is gonna probably... Oh, yeah, this leads me back to a loophole. I see. Okay, so now... We still need to avoid the nurse because we need the crowbar. We're just gonna make her angry. Oh, and it shows the key cards at the bottom right as well. Okay. Uh, we will have to grab the crowbar. Which was over here. Are you not remembering anything? Here we go. Okay. And now we just simply loop her. Lady. Run! Come over here! What the fuck? How does she make so many steps? She's crazy! Um, don't you see me? I'm here! Here she comes. Um. What the fuck? Just run. Bye bye! Doesn't know Pepe laugh. We have the crowbar and the key card. Boom, boom, leave. Let's go next area. After salvaging a crowbar from the sick ward storage, you manage to barely avoid Haddle Trout's grasp and escape into the courtyard. New area. Ooh, what what evil possibly lurks in the in the courtyard? Come on now. Mitsuki, thank you for the 12 months. Uh-oh. Of course, it's got to be night. It can't be a nice day. This is not that big. I mean, maybe there's more buildings. I hear evil noises. Okay, never mind. It is very big. What the fuck is this courtyard set up even as well? This is crazy. Um, oh, trash can. Looks disgusting. There's another one of these plugs. Another plug. But this one is sealed as well. Huh? Let me guess, red key card? Of course. What the fuck? Um, hi. Wow, what a curious sight. You lost, son? Well, don't despair. There's no better place to get lost than this yard. So many hidden treasures around here. I could show you around. Only for a bit of juicy, grimy trash, of course. Okay, I... There was a trash can that was open over here. Maybe I can grab that. This one. Take some trash. I'm a genius. We have finally got a friend. Also, it's wheelchair accessible, by the way. <laughs> of course it is. Uh, where'd you go? Here, I got trash for you. I got trash? Give trash. Oh, yeah, this is the shit. It's literal shit, actually. What? Don't look at me like that. <laughs> This is the best food you can get around here. I mean, that might be right. Who knows? I wouldn't want to eat Chef Sour's muck, honestly. Anyway, let's get going and see what we can find. Did you never know what to expect in this game? It's a bibliotheque. Bibli oh, no! I didn't, I didn't mean to leave! A run-down, dusty-looking corridor lies before you. The smell of old books is in the air, and the walls are covered in cobwebs. The place seems to be completely abandoned apart from the few dim lights. Uh oh, we're gonna get in trouble now because I escaped the trash man. Uh, there's a person sitting there. The attic? Isn't it supposed to be a bibli bibliotheque or whatever? The library? I'm assuming. Thanks, Zaraf. Thank you for the prime. Uh, hello? I want here? Uh, hi there. You look like a prisoner. Sleepy Doku. Huh? Oh, please pardon me. I must have dozed off. What I'm up to? 
Oh, I was looking for Gregory, you see. I was talking to the trash guy outside and he wasn't able to find him. He's very tall. So I thought he might be here. But alas, he wasn't. I don't know what to do anymore. Hey, if you find him, could you bring him to me? I'd be forever in your debt. Okay, but you're looking for a glass of water. We're looking for Gregory, and we want to talk to the trash man. There's lots of stuff to do. There's the biblioteca. Pick up here first, though. Any item? What is this? That looks ominous. Cobwebs. It's going to be a maze. pick up anything always raining in here i mean if it's anything like uh oh uh, no it is a loophole if it's anything like uh the netherlands it's gonna be raining all the time uh this looks like a like a loophole that's supposed to be activated maybe later oh, we can go up even more This is already, oh, already lots of books here. Very ominous. What's your name, Mac? Thank you for the three. Um, what is this hospital bed doing over here? People getting electroshock. Hello? Anyone up here with me? Oh, hi. You're not even sitting on the damn chair. That's not how you use a chair, you idiot. Dr. Hauser, what? Another one? My god, what a rush. Are you looking for your plush animal? Or maybe you're hoping for a stash of leftover drugs. Well, I hate to break it to you, but you won't find any of that here. Space is dedicated to the accumulation of knowledge. Not very interesting to you, I presume. You still want to have a look around? Hmm, fine by me. But under one condition, be quiet. Don't, do not take anything. Okay, if we take anything, he's going to get immediately mad. Seems pretty chill right now, but I feel like he's about to explode if we pick up a single book. Uh, the clinic again. There's no looping spots here, so there's no way we're gonna avoid him. And the sounds are... As soon as the music starts playing, you know stuff's, uh, stuff's about to go down in this game. Um. Locked. Well, damn! Oh, there it is. Uh-oh. Take the attic key. I mean, you said not to take anything, but... This might be my only way out. I'm sure he won't notice anything. I'm sure he won't notice. They're quiet before the storm. <laughs> what? Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. You really like snooping around other people's belongings, don't you? Well, guess what? I've got a gift for you on my desk. Go and get it! What the fuck? He's everywhere. How's he doing it? Ah, he's everywhere! Help! What the fuck? He's teleporting. Oh, no! You're all the same. Ow, my face. Dude, of course I should have... Jesus Christ, what's he doing to me? I should have known. I should have known he'd be there one more time. No one steals from Dr. Hauser. You had no bad intentions, but to him it was obvious. You are just another petty thief looking to snatch some of the vast knowledge Hauser has so carefully obtained. Enraged, he pushes you to the floor, which causes the old wound to burst, sending you falling to the lower floor. Or the old wood. Oh, that's the... That's the icon of the game, so this must be important. Hauser's library. Okay. This was a way forward. Probably could have avoided him, though. 
We're gonna go. We're not gonna go into the basement. Oh, there we go. Orange. Um, everything is broken here. Can we even open this? Purple key card. This is also purple. Right, well, we have. We don't even have the red key card, let alone the purple one. Uh, hello. It's a loophole. Oh, I see. I see. Probably not gonna be anything in here. It's a golden toilet. What the fuck? Am I gonna give that to the other guy? Wait a minute. Am I gonna give that to the dude who clogged the shitter? Alright, well, here we go. Uh, first, though, I kinda wanna try and... Cause obviously we can we can try the sick yard. I want to go to there's so many places to go I want to go to Hauser's library and avoid getting captured by him first Just just to see if that's possible Then we still need to go to the courtyard and talk to mr. Trash man um, Because he seemed to be actually friendly friendly That's an interesting way of going about things this is this re game required wait. Oh I'm going the wrong way whoopsie daisy uh, this game- wait. Oh, Hauser's library is not the same as the attic. Whoops. Uh, I'm stupid. <laughs> there, attic. That's where I want to go. Bad girl, pig me. Oh, thank you for the 19. Okay, here we go. Um, you just do the exact same thing again. Because we can- can we go in here? Oh, that's locked. I, I avoided that door because I was like, I don't want to move on to the next area. Oh, sir, I am not here to steal. I Could I please borrow the attic key? That's all I'm asking. I don't want to keep it. I just want to open the door. Otherwise, I can't get out. There are multiple endings to this game? Probably. Hi there, sir. I'm not even going to talk to you this time, so you have no... Oh. Never mind, I'm going to have to talk to you. <laughs> What do you think you're doing? Another one. You come to the chase. Lisa, thank you for the five. He's speaking the language of gods. Yes, I would sleep. Is this like sped up German bullshit? Do not take anything. Alright, here we go. Is this what German sounds like? I'm pretty fucked. Alright, here we go. Take the key! <laughs> take the attic key. <laughs> And there he is. Wait, wasn't he here? There we go. Okay, now don't mess this up. You really think snooping around other people's belongings or you really like it? Yes, I do. Okay, but the, the, the gift... Oh, God. The gift looked like... Is that a toilet with a plant in it? Did you see that? Oh, God. Ah! I don't get greedy. Don't do not get greedy. There we go. Okay, can we get it now? What is this? It's a giant teddy bear. Take teddy bear. What a huge lad. <laughs> what a huge lad indeed. Can I loop him? What the fuck? What do I need the teddy bear for? Can I now make it back or is he still gonna be here? I guess I could let myself be captured now because I got something new. Uh, it doesn't seem like he's teleporting back here. It's a new area. Not very fast, at least. Oh god, what the fuck? What is this noise? Oh, is it oh wait, we're down here! Oh, I see. We've been here before. Okay, so this doesn't actually lead anywhere. 
What do we do then? Do we just get captured or do can we go back to the loophole somehow? Can we now go into Hauser's bibliotheque? We cannot. Okay, I guess we're just gonna have to say hi to Mr. Hauser. So he brings us to the next area. Why would he give us a gift if he doesn't want us to take anything? It seems like the opposite of what you want. Yeah, we if we give the Maybe that dude that was like who wanted a friend. What if we give it to that guy? Uh, did this get destroyed? Excuse me. Wait, huh? Didn't we get in through here? Excuse me. Uh oh, I think it all it's destroyed. There was a vent downstairs. There was. I didn't see it. Yeah, it could be for the sleepy guy. Servant. downstairs I do not see a vent oh here this guy yeah 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 give the i i didn't think he was here give teddy bear there we go <laughs> gregory <laughs> i can't believe you found him he actually was in the attic oh no hauser will not be happy you taking things from him you should get out of here as quickly as possible but I will not forget what you did for me. Until we meet again. You will not forget. Alright, can we now go back to the courtyard? Instead of being captured by the guy? The very Okay, so you can get back and forth between this area and the courtyard. Okay. And we might have to give you trash again. Oh. Yes, maybe. I'm just gonna grab some trash just in case. So he can lead me around. Take some trash. Viking XC, thank you for the 10. Life's Destiny, thank you for the 9. Or for the 7. Hello, sir. Hello, trash man. I got a gift for you. There you go. You make nasty noises. Oh, yeah, this is the shit. What? Do not look at me in like that the best food you can get around here i wouldn't want to eat chef's chef sours muck honestly nom, nom, nom. anyway let's get going and see what we can find yes leave me around there we go what are you gonna do many ways to go here i'm just gonna follow this guy for now i hear a note or a loophole You're, like, insanely slow, man. Couldn't you go... Would you look at that? A golden pocket watch. Okay, it looks like something a patient would keep. It's such a shame they've lost it. You want it? I'll take it. Alright. Sure, do we keep following him or what now? Alright, we got another item. I don't think we have found any place that we need that. Wash it. Kurt, where are you going? Crash man is thick. Crash man, what are you doing? Are you leading me anywhere? I can't open any of these doors. Are you gonna eat from the trash cans here? You're bro- I think that was what he is gonna do. I don't think he's doing anything more. Is this bathhouse in German? Leave area? I think I'm gonna leave because I don't think he's actually gonna do anything. Yes, it is. Okay. Oh. Aha, there's a loophole in here as well if we want to. Let me see. Alright, let's just go into the bathhouse. Maybe we can wash the pocket watch. New area. A damp gush of warm air graces your face as you enter the building on the far end of the courtyard. This is the bathhouse. Is this based on a real place or is this just, it's probably a made up place. The bathhouse. I've played a whole horror game around bathhouses. Hey, Zetrix, what's up? Um, oh, I don't want to leave. Who is this thing? Oh, that's a beard. I thought it was some kind of fucked up mask. I see. Uh, dude, that guy's buff as hell. Hello, sir. 
Good day. How are we feeling? Here for our aqua therapy sessions? Dot, dot, dot. You're a bit late then, aren't you? Oh, don't worry about it too much. Let's see. Oh, you're not on my list. How do you know my name? How do you know how to check? Mm, technically, I cannot let you participate. But Astrid isn't here today. Don't actually know why. Anyhow, she's usually really strict about this, but I don't mind. But I don't mind. Good. Get undressed then and meet me and the others in the back. Uh-oh. Gonna be sexy times. I'm gonna have to censor this. Undress! <laughs> Excuse me. Can't get naked. I'm gonna get banned. All right, well, here we go. Time to get naked. I'm naked. <laughs> I took off my clothes. I hope I have my underwear still on. Oh, um, another plug, another plug. But this one's sealed as well. Um, okay. Where do I join you guys? Through here? Free, privat. Oh, here. Uh, oh my god, they're actually naked. They all are covering up the peepees. They're actual booties. Hi there. All right, welcome to today's aqua therapy session, everybody. Before we can get started, I'd like to ask you all to take a shower. It's absolutely crucial. Showers are in the next room. Meet me at the main pool once you're properly cleaned. What the fuck? All right, I'll go in. The, I'll go with these guys. Oh my god! Take a shower, yes, please. They don't have any peepees. What happened to the peepees? Look at my feet. I can't. And I got no. I can't see my own feet. They're candles. What, what sound are these people making? Oh, what the fuck? Uh, what was that? Something feels different. Where is everybody? Um, was I hallucinating? What a fucked up hallucination that was. Can I still take a shower? I still take a shower. Beautiful. Um, you know, there's so much smoke here. Shower smoke. What the fuck did that guy just say? He said some German bullshit. Uh, can I swim? I cannot swim. Hello, I think you were the four. Oh god. What happens if he gets me? He's coming. Oh lord, he's coming! Oh no, it's locked! Ah! What the fuck, Wolfram, please? I didn't mean it. Alright, what happens if it gets me? Well, how did he get behind me? <laughs> oh, it's aqua therapy time? Kind of comfy. The water is blocking it. He was coming right from behind. What the hell, man? Um, how'd you fill the whole building with water? This seems like it wasn't meant for this. Start pump. Oh god, what the fuck was that? Ah, what the hell? It's Siren Head! Excuse me. What the fuck? It's Waterhead. Stop it! Fuck you! He's not attacking me, I'm chasing him. I can't use the valves, excuse me? What the fuck? 
What is going on? Stop! He's doing the exact. He's. There's no way I can. Get oh, there we go. No, I can. Wait, what? Oh, he's just running away from me. What the fuck? What if I just cut him off? Hi. So, what if I give him a shower? Fuck you. Okay, lead him into some corner. How the fuck? Get up! You piece of shit! Fuck you. Okay, what do I do? Oh, in here! I need to lead him in there. I need to lead him in there. He's gonna drown in there. How ironic. You scare off. And then... Boom! No! Not that way! Fuck. No, go this way. Continue. Okay, here. And then we scare him this way. Inspect! The pipe is installed pretty low. Uh-huh. Someone tall could hit their head on this. Here he goes. Boing. Send the belt. <laughs> what the fuck? This guy is crazy. Okay, and then we go... Fuck, how do we do this? Do I need to just make him hit it again? I guess. Boing! Turn him off. That did it. The water is draining. <laughs> I should be able to open the exit door now. That was fucking wild. <laughs> it all makes sense. Where's the exit door? I completely forgot. Here, right? Yes. What the fuck? And now we're going to get murdered by Wolfram. Another story. An article about Nurse Astrid leaving the clinicum. I'm very sad to see her leave. She was a good soul, Randolph says. This seems a bit odd to me. Hmm. Oh, another. Well, we did it. Did we get anything? We have a golden toilet, right? We don't have any. We got an achievement called the attic. What does that do? Complete all of the paths in the attic. Okay, so the attic is done. No more. Uh, now the question is, we have the bathhouse, which we still have something. I kind of want to see going to the sick ward and then giving the guy the golden toilet. He probably doesn't really care, but I want to ch I want to try. I want to try it anyway. Maybe it'll work. Yeah, I might want to put on my clothes if I'm still not wearing anything, but I'm assuming I do. Let's see. Get ready to be jump scared. <laughs> The fucking shitter is clogged again, and I've made a bit of a mess. Could you give me a hand? I could give you a golden toilet if you want. It probably needs water, though, right? Oh, God. Okay, he wants a glass of water. Being stuck on the shitter made me quite thirsty. Okay, I need a glass of water for this guy, so... Did he just flush himself? Could be interesting. How? What just happened? Did he flush himself? What did he say? He said something. Okay, now we're gonna... Okay, now we have to get the crowbar again and escape. Oh god, there she is. What, what do you mean? Run around her. Road. No, never mind. All right, I'm dead. <laughs> Open. <laughs> okay, okay. All the immensely consummated. Wait, whoa, whoa, what does it say? What did it say? Wait, what? 
It was a new thing? Excuse me? Cafeteria? Wait, what did it say? Can anyone, <laughs> can anyone clip that? That's <laughs> something about the constipated patient. Okay, I'm in a new area now. I, I did, I just expected that would be the exact same thing, but nope. All right, interesting. Maybe because it was a different path since I didn't have the crowbar. Who knows? All right, well, that led somewhere. What did it say? Let's see. What did it say? People clipped it. Uh, oh, I can't freaking use Twitch because I'm logged out. God! Let's see. I'm trying to find it. Touch himself! Let's see. What did it say? It said... All the immensely constipated, all the immensely constipated patient wanted after two torturous hours on the pot was a glass of water. It's a real shame you weren't able to find one in time. Nurse Heideltrout isn't too happy about that and will relocate you to another ward. Okay, here we go. That was the story. Yeah, I see other people also wrote it down. Thank you guys. Thank you. Okay, this is a new area. There's a vent here. Probably gonna have to go through that. Yep. Maybe here we can find the water. We accidentally stumbled upon a whole new area. I guess you need to basically try all combinations of things. What the fuck was that? Yeah. I don't like it went in here. You have the canteen. Could be interesting. Unsere heutige. What the fuck? <laughs> That's like the patients who are celebrating their birthday today, I think. There's two of them. Ulrich and Duku. Hmm. Wait, wasn't Duku the guy with the teddy bear? TLG, thank you for the sub. And Windfell, thank you for the 10 months. Okay, let's take the... Uh, take this. So we gave, him a, we gave him a teddy bear. We gave him a birthday present. We're so nice. Oh, uh, we can't go in here. Uh, there's a per people sitting here for a birthday party. What the frick? Um, hi there. How are you guys? Uh, you having a great time over here? Looks like you're at a birthday party, Piggy. Everyone showed up. Go on, have a seat. We are having Fleischschuppe for supper. Speaking of Fleischschuppe, since you're late and it's my birthday, would you mind sneaking into the kitchen and seasoning it properly? That, uh, Chef, Sa Chef Sour is notoriously bad at that. Meat soup, yeah. I tell you which seasoning I want and you do the job. If not, just sit down and wait for the soup to be served. It's gonna be quite horrendous though. Ask for recipes. You'll do it. This is the best birthday ever. Right, so I would like some pepper, chili powder, and paprika powder. Add those to the flesh chupa, and the flesh will be something. Oh, by the way, Sour doesn't like being seasoned very much. You'll have to sneak up on him from behind. Don't let him catch you. Okay, chili, what was it again? I already forgot. Uh, you're not using this chair properly. This is not how you do it. You okay over there? Pepper, chili, and paprika. Okay. We got that. A uh, happy 30th birthday. Kitchen. We need the spices first, though. Oh, here we go. Brown nutmeg. Don't need that. Pepper, yes. Garlic powder, no. We need more. Not enough. Um. Excuse me? Why does the kitchen not have pots or pans? Oh, God. Paprika, yes. And then chili powder. Pick up in, on him from behind. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Chef Sour was absolutely enraged to find you sniffing around in his kitchen. You were not a cook anyway, so what were you thinking? Your life flashes before your eyes as you see the giant mass of flesh and metal gushing towards you, ultimately running you over. 
It turned around right in time. What the fuck? <laughs> That's so bullshit. Oh, come on. Are we going to be back? Oh, we need to go through this again. Okay, so we're just going to be sent back. This is like the the failure state room where you have to uh, take the loophole. Okay, we can do that. That was... Oh, never mind. There's a new document. A transcript of Randolph's inauguration speech. He speaks of a bright, bright future and major strides in medical research. He's good at talking, that's for sure. I'm not seeing that whole bright future thing in this place, though. Okay. We got more lore. How much lore do we have? Like four or five. Five lore. Okay, well, let's go back to the... We'll go to the cafeteria. And do the do that properly. I'm pretty sure I was doing that properly. I just was slightly too slow. Um, and they... Uh, he turned around right in time. Cooper becomes the soup. Did he put me in the soup? Is he part of the soup? Like, what, what the fuck was that guy? What is... Oh, this is the guy. He's attached to the soup. He is the soup. Oh, of course. <laughs> of course he is. Okay, so we're, we're eating the guy. He doesn't. That's why he doesn't like being seasoned. Of course. He's one with the soup. Uh, I don't need to ask you for the recipe again because you already know it. Uh, it's chili powder. I'm assuming it's going to be in the same place again. No, never mind. It's not in the same place. Okay. And then we need... Chili, paprika, and something else. I forgot, but I'll see it. I'll know it when I see it. Rosemary. Ah! Pepper! Pepper. Jesus Christ. Just get the shit out of me. Don't you fucking season me! <laughs> I did, I did! Oh, no, come on, you piece of shit! Kitchen. Wait, did I already do it? If Sarah was ever. Okay, I don't know. I guess I'll have to do it again. What the fuck? Did I not click the button? I swear I did it! God damn it. Okay, well, we got this. It's some pop up. I clicked some kind of pop up. I don't know what it was, though. Okay, I have to do it three times, but I tried to do it again and he wouldn't allow me. Why don't we just throw it all in at once? That's stupid. Oh, it's a new recipe every time. That's why. Oh. I see. The recipe changes. Stupid. I understand. All right. Oh. Well, why don't, why don't you make up your mind and decide on the recipe? Cuz I'm only doing this once. Don't Yeah, he said don't you fucking season me. Doesn't like being seasoned. Why is he sitting in the pot? That seems not hygienic. It seems unhealthy. All the fucking sounds, man. All right, so apparently you want something different every time. How about you give me the recipe? Everyone showed up. Yes. I love the feet. All right, what do you want? I will. I wish you could skip the the dialogue. What if we just sit down? All right, here we go. Ask for recipe. You'll do it. Yes, I will do it. Just give me the damn recipe. All right, what does he want? All right, so I would like some rosemary, garlic powder, and chili powder. Okay, so we need to do it different every time. Rosemary, garlic powder, and chili powder. Okay, let's see. Rosemary, rosemary, garlic powder, and chili powder. I'm gonna come through here, right? Yes. Garlic powder and chili powder. All right, here we go. Let's not mess it up this time. 
I'll be sneaky. I seasoned him. I seasoned you. Is that is that it? Did I do it? Or do I have to? I don't know. Let's see. Did I do it? Are you happy? I see how it is. Wait, what? I thought this party couldn't possibly get more depressing. I did it. What do you mean? Uh, just sit down and wait for the soup. Excuse me. Do you have to do it three times? Maybe you have to do it three times. I only. Okay. I see. I understand. He's a sad boy. I don't want to. I don't want to get you the stinky soup. I want to get you good soup. Get out of the kitchen now. Did I get the recipe wrong? What the fuck, brother? I, I, it's not allowing me to season him again. Like, look, it's I not, what the fuck? It's not allowing me. Yo, you can only hold one at the time. Why can you pick up all of them at the same time then? Okay, I understand now. That's super annoying. Okay, so we'll just have to sit down. I guess this will, this will be a tasteless birthday. I did not know that. Experience the fly super. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yummy. <laughs> After hearing so much about Sour's infamous fly shupa, you finally get it. You have to taste it, and it even surpassed your expectations it is truly the most vile thing anyone could even think of concocting you cannot take the foul stench and horrific taste for long and pass out on the spot <laughs> what the fuck okay well so every, one at a time i see that's that was not clear to me oh there's another lore though it's a draft written by nurse astrid which criticizes randall's research paper and lists obvious mistakes it's definitely not finished, so it probably wasn't published. But someone must have found it if it's out here. And there's a crown? Take the crown? It's a birthday patient's paper crown. You can go back. Maybe he wants to give it to me for this for seasoning the soup. I didn't season the soup, though. Did I? <laughs> I'm confused. Okay, there's a... We can go back into the ca ca canteen. Can we? Not feeling like eating more soup. Okay. I mean, I, I will go over there because I want to properly season the soup. I'm still happy that we did it this way first because this was... We should always... Wait, never mind. I got an achievement. Complete all paths in the cafeteria. Excuse me? I did it? I did season it? Wait, but he, he said he was sad. Wait, what? Did I do both of them at the same time? You cannot do it again. What? I'm confused. I'm, I don't know. I guess I did it. Anyway, okay. So I guess we did it. It says we have completed all paths. Oh, and the question marks is where we have still stuff to do. I would love to season the soup, but I guess not. Okay, we have houses library. What 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 can we do? Um, hmm, let's see. You sat down, so you filled it. I mean, isn't this whole game about looping and time like being convoluted? How would I know that that was the only thing so far that's been a one-time change? Like, everything so far I could try over and over and over and over and over again because that's the whole point of the game. How did I- how would I know that that was a one-time thing? That seems ridiculous. Okay, anyway, it's fine because we still got the crown anyway. Um, okay, so what do- we also have the watch. We have the crown and we have the watch. Hmm, what do we do with this? I'm confused. Uh, electroshock, sick ward. Is there anyone who we- we haven't talked to yet the toilet guy why is this so marked um hmm. we have six nine by the way nice ring the recession bell what is the recession bell i don't remember this electroshock has the yellow card thing that's true there is a yellow do we have the yellow card oh yeah we do have the yellow card but we got it from the electroshock ward i don't think there's much to do with that there all right, let's go to the sick ward and see if we can do anything here. Is there, this is the place where the, the guy is? Yes. Is there a bell here? People are saying I should ring a bell. 
It sure looks inviting. Where's the bell? Uh, I'm looking for a bell. You could also give the crown to the... No, but that's not a different path anymore. Uh, hi there. Excuse me, I'm in a bit of a pickle. <laughs> Every time, dude. Fucking shitter a squad. I need to give him water. Could you give me a hand? Yeah, the, the, the bell would probably be here, no? Is there a bell? I don't see anything. Um, what is this? The reception. Shouldn't this be occupied at this time? No one here gives a damn about their job, do they? Hmm. I don't think so. Is this something we've seen before, or is this just people that have seen the game before that know about this bell? Because I, I don't remember ever seeing a bell. Uh, flooded stairs in the bathhouse where you had the boss fight against the shower head. I don't remember. Um, let's see. Hey there, sir. What if, if I walk away? I see. Are we gonna get attacked immediately? No. Oh. Yeah, I don't think this is it. I don't think we need to go here. Let's just be captured. I mean, obviously we need to go here at some point, but I don't know what... I think we need water. We need water to finish this. Ask and thank you for the two. Okay. Let's, uh, we go to the... Uh, the birthday area again. Ask him. What the heck? And also, unfriendly fire. Thank you for the 11. I missed that. Okay, maybe we can try seasoning the soup. I don't know. I'm not sure. All this for a glass of water? Yeah, what the fuck? Let us see. I'm confused. It's an interesting game, though. This, like... Soup in a wheelchair. So he still exists. Can we really not season the soup? I want to season the soup, man. Yeah, we could go to the bathhouse as well. Obviously. Because uh, there's well, there's still things to complete there. The only ones we've completed is this area and the attic. Those are the only ones where apparently there's nothing else to do. Just... Now, let's see. Can I not do you? Oh, wait, he doesn't have a crown anymore. Hi there. Oh, how exciting. Wait, what? Everyone showed up. Can we not? Can we do the? I would love to do the seasoning to make you happy. Let's try out actually properly seasoning the soup. You're late and it's my birthday. Do we have to do it one at a time? That's super confusing. Is he going to be happy birthday boy? I'll just sit down and we'll not do that. Maybe the order is important as well. What the fuck? Okay, let's see. Ask for recipe. What do you have? This is the best birthday ever. Yeah, just tell me the damn recipe. All right, so I would like some. Okay, one at a time. We're going to do rosemary pepper chili powder. Let's do it in that order as well, just in case. Okay. Uh, let's see. A rosemary first. Rosemary. Pepper is here. Pepper's not here. Okay. Rosemary. This is gonna be hard though. Pick up behind you. Did I do it? Jesus Christmas. I don't know if I did it. I think I did it. Yes, uh, yes, I did it. Okay, rosemary pepper now. Pepper, 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 pepper. Oh, God. Pepper, chili powder. You're gonna turn around? I did it. Wait. It, that was chili powder, right? I did it. No, I put all of them in. Let's see. Is he gonna be happy now? Are you a happy birthday boy now? 
What do you mean, sad? Huh? I don't understand. I did it. All right. I don't. Maybe this. I don't know. <laughs> is it bugged? I I did it one at a time. The right recipe. I don't know. I get whatever. You can't. You don't talk to him. Why? <laughs> I don't know anyway okay so we can do that so there's no way to properly season that maybe there is but i tried it i tried it one at a time um anyway uh we have a birthday crown and we have a um we have the pocket watch and we just need to figure out where to use that so let's see where do we do that uh core jar there's still more let's go into the bathhouse because there was that one stairway downwards that was blocked off because of the water. And let's see if we can actually go there now. Also, you're still here. I'm not going to fall for your traps again, you weirdo. I can't go in here. Oh, fuck. Maybe I have to undress. Seasoning can't save this soup. Yeah, I might just have to talk to you. God damn it. All right. Here we go. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Yeah, we could give the crown to... But they said we were done in the attic, so I don't know. Don't shower. Is the shower like drugs? I don't know. I will take take off my clothes. Uh, All right, here we go. Undress button. They actually recorded undressing noises for this. There we go. Now we can go in here, right? Because we couldn't... Yeah, we couldn't do that before. We have to do this. Locked. Where are you guys? There they are. <laughs> what the fuck is with your face? So don't take a shower this time. I think that's the idea here. Showers are in the next room. So what if I just run through it? What? 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 I do want to participate. I didn't realize you were going to get mad. Come on, quit this nonsense and take a shower. Okay, 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 dude. Same goes for the others. What the fuck? I was just going to the... What? Excuse me, sir. What the hell was that? The rude? The fuck? <laughs> what the hell was that? Oh, there's a note here, though. Wait. That was a... That was weird. Wait, there's a note. Downstairs? Is this another path? I'm so confused. What what happened? Is it not a bug? Joseph Randolph announces the opening of the Hillwald Dental Milk. Marvel added, this is my greatest work yet. What did that say? The medical community will thank me in due time, he says. What a self-centered prick. Okay, well that's another an dental clinic. I thought you said milk. <laughs> okay, but that's another. Uh... Go go go! We got seven now or eight? Yeah, we got seven. Okay. I mean, I want to try that again though. Let's try that again, and then actually properly do his stuff. I don't want to take a shower though. Yes. Hi there. I'm gonna talk to you. <sighs> Please. Dental uh, milk, great for your teeth. Wasn't milk? I remember. There's like some of some things that we used to think were really good for you, or were like good for you. Uh, that then science proved wrong. I remember in in elementary school, every time after food, we would be required to brush our teeth. But then during my elementary school years, research came out that brushing your teeth right after food is actually bad for your teeth because it'll like kind of liquefy the out. I don't know what it does. It like makes the outside layer of your teeth temporarily brittle. So if you brush your teeth after food, right after food, it's bad for your teeth. So then we turn it around and we like no longer brushed our teeth before food. 
that's one of those things that always stuck with me like oh interesting i did i used to do this thing it's like it, it kind of reminds me of how back in the day people used to think that smoking was good for you <laughs> or like that smoking was not bad for you at least like science just science will update itself Uh, where the fuck are you? There. Okay, I'm gonna be nice boy this time. No, no running away. Okay. I will take a shower. Showers are in the next room. Meet me in the main pool once you're properly cleaned. Um... Do I, like, get out of here somehow? What if I don't, like, actually take a shower? But I just run away? I just run through? I didn't take a shower! Aha! I'm running. Uh, I'm still... Uh, uh-oh. He's coming! What? What was that? Did the shower still make me feel crazy? I go in here? None of these. Okay, maybe I shouldn't shouldn't have gone through the shower. I'm not sure. Um, can't go in the pool. I guess I could avoid the the guy, but I don't know what that does for me. He comes out of this room, right? There. Yes. Hi. Um. Okay, he chases me. What the fuck? <laughs> Stop it! What do I do? He just grabs you. And then I get sent to the other place. I can't dive in the pool. How do I avoid taking a shower? Can you, like, go through here? What is this? What is... Excuse me? It stinks? I don't even want to know what's behind this door. Oh, there's something behind this door? I want to know what's behind that door. this excuse me oh there's another plug we can't do anything with those we need to we need to remember where all the plugs were because we're gonna obviously oh god fuck run yeah i don't think this is anything i don't know agony is thinking for the seven months i don't know what i'm supposed to do maybe take another shower I can't. Oh, here. Yeah, I'm taking a shower. Are you happy now? I'm confused. Seems like taking a shower is the only option. There's no other way through. And if you run away, he's just going to get you anyway. Oh, maybe this way. Excuse me. No, it's locked. What the hell, man? Yeah, I don't know. I don't think this is anything. All right. Well, at least we tried not taking a shower. Can you kidnap me, please, sir? I would like to... What the fuck did you just say? All right, here we go. Whatever. I don't think there was anything else there. Maybe now we can... Maybe this siren head guy will not attack? He probably will, right? Water is blocking it. Try this again. Uh, maybe I should go the stairway down. Let's try that after doing this thing. Oh, there he is. Alright, well... <laughs> you know what to do. Um, where the fuck are you going, sir? I need you to run to the pipe. It's right here. No, that was the perfect place. You were standing right where I wanted you to. It's like Mikolaj from Bloodborne, dude. What's on the man's head? It's a shower thing. Go. He, do at least he even makes similar noises. 
Water flow has decreased. Oh, this way. Let's run. That's kind of weird. There you go. Boing! Okay. So now instead of going through the door, we're gonna see if we can go down the stairs. Because there were stairs here somewhere, if I remember correctly. Maybe those stairs are accessible now too. This one. Yes. No, it's this actually is just a pool. Okay, never mind. I mean we tried. We're trying out different options. I can it's just seems like we're getting stuck. I hear sad noises. Hello, Mr. Showerhead, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. Yeah, I don't think there's any anything here. Nothing here. Alright, whatever. Close. Did I go? Yeah, this is just a teleporter. Okay, so the shower is just a complete dead end. There's nothing here. I mean, eh? It still says that there is something there, though, but I don't know. We can't really get to it. Let's see. So let's just go because we haven't done much in his library. There is something. We'll have to figure it out another time. Um, Electroshock ward. Let's just go to the library because we've only been here once. Maybe we can find something. Let's see. And yeah, maybe we need to do something else. I don't know. Maybe we need something to get into the stinky room. Oh, but here you need the purple key. Okay, never mind. I can't. Oh, hi. What the hell? Hello there. Good God. How did all this happen? It was really scary. You know that. Don't ever do that again. Well, despite all this, you've made it into the library. How many people manage to do this nowadays? Houser has moved most of his books up into the attic and locked this place up. But seeing that you're here now and you've helped me find Gregory, I thought it would be only fair to help out however I help you out however I can. I'm not leaving these walls though. I wish I might still be lurking around here. Uh, all right, we're going. Can I help? Can I go in the walls? Hello? Are you doing something? Can you help me out? Huh? This is just gonna. Wait. Yeah, this just leads back to this portal. Excuse me. I thought you were gonna help me. I hear music. The fuck? My Biff, thank you for the 17. Um, what kind of help are you providing me? Feels like you're not really doing anything. What the fuck? Yeah, I can also get... Wasn't he... Isn't it his birthday? What? I can't go in the walls here. Maybe crouch? No. I don't know. Maybe there's an maybe I need to go somewhere else. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like he's not doing anything here, but maybe we need to go somewhere else and there he does something. I don't know. Because right here, the only thing I can do is go into this portal. So I guess we're gonna have to go somewhere else. Mischievous, thank you for the 19, and Bartishko, thank you for the prime. Okay. Um so let's see. That one is, st is stuck for now. The sick ward was also seemingly a dead end for now. Let's go into the courtyard. There might be more to explore in the courtyard. I don't know. Let's see. What is going on? That's the bibliotheque. We don't care. Um, I don't know if these doors actually open. Ruth, so we need a red key card. Which we're probably going to get from the nurse. And we need to open these plugs somehow. All these fucking doors are locked. What's this? Lock. Look, I'm just looping back where I originally came from. Let's see. I'm not going back there yet. So this is where we started. I wonder where we need to use the the clock. 
Because we have a clock and a golden toilet. But it's, there's no way to open like an inventory or something. Like I can't inspect them in any way. There was a yellow keycard door in the electroshock ward, right? Maybe we gotta go there. Also, wait, there's more trash. Can I give you more trash? Give trash. Maybe I can give him many trash. Maybe that's what I gotta do. Oh yeah, this is the shit. Can I give you more trash? I have more trash for you. You like that? Yeah, you already set this. Dot, dot, dot. What? Don't look at me like that. This is the best food you can get around here. You only have a golden pocket watch, not a toilet. Where did I use the toilet then? I definitely had a toilet as well. Where did I use the toilet? Was that what I did to get the different ending in the sick ward? Take some trash. I hear stuff in here. There's a teleporter over here. Is he gonna dig up something else now? Sit door. What are you gonna do? Oh, I already have the pocket watch. Wait, what? Give him more trash? What is going on? You can just keep feeding him trash? And he keeps giving me pocket watch. But he says the exact same thing every time. What the hell? <laughs> Excuse me. This is the best food you can get. Maybe I need to give him super special trash. All right. Are you going to dig up this thing again? Anyway, let's get going and see what we can find. He goes somewhere else now. Wait a minute. Oh, he's going to dig into all of these. Okay, so we need... We need to grab multiple trash. Is he? He does seem to do it. Oh, what's he gonna take? Oh, it said take pocket watch for like a split second there. I don't know if you saw it. So I think, I think this is just gonna bug him out. I don't think this is... I don't think you're supposed to do this. Wait, what are you doing? Okay, it's just gonna go back. Yeah, I, I don't think you can give him multiple trash. I mean, at least we... This is fucked. All right, this is not the answer. Where the hell do we go? But there is more things to do here. Also, what did it say here for a second? It said take something. What? When I walk this way, it said something on the screen. Okay, he's very hungry. Can I give him more trash? I'm just feeding him lots of trash. He's gonna eventually grow up. So I'm assuming that the other ending out of the courtyard is just this. So we need to find the red key card somehow. Let's go back to the electroshock ward and see if we can do something there. Because I don't think this trash guy is really going to do much. I don't know. We could go into the bathhouse, but I don't want to go through all of that again. Where is the teleporter? What the fuck? What is all of this? Mini suit. I don't know how they get the fuck out of here. Help! Oh, I hear a teleport. I hear it in there. But I can't get there. I might just have to go into a random house. Yeah, in this thing is a teleporter. Oh, here. Aha. Okay. There we go. All right, now, so let's see. We're going to go to the Electroshock Ward just to see if there's something else there. I doubt it, but we'll find out. So do we have the maintenance key already? We do not have the maintenance key, so we're going to have to get that again. But we do have the yellow key card, so can we just, like, run past her? Let's see. Blah, blah, blah. That means maintenance. Let's see. Yeah, there was a yellow door here. Oh, there she comes. <laughs> Good day. Oh, can I get past you? I'm gonna run past you. I don't want to deal with you. Ah, God, the fuck! All right, don't, don't do that. Don't make Anne angry. You should not have messed with Nurse Anne. She is usually known for her great patience and kindness. 
But she too has her boundaries. All you have to do is wait for her to return. Was that really too much to ask? Okay, don't do that. <laughs> Noted. What the fuck? Whoa. Wait, is there another note though? There's, wait, what? This is a way to just... How old Clinicum staff on Joseph Randall? A compilation of opinions on their new chief doctor. Most of them seem to like him. Nurse Astrid is especially skeptic though. Okay. That's another one. So we have eight out of nine different knowledge things. I'm guessing these show up er oh. I'm guessing these show up in different locations. But anyway, we're going back to her and actually doing this properly. Uh, I got an- wait, no, I got an achievement! Oh, the electroshock ward. Complete all paths in the electroshock ward. Okay, so never mind. We did do it properly. Okay. So we just did another path. Which means there is no yellow door here that we have to go to. Okay. So what else do we do then? What other path is there? So paths also include failing, apparently. Okay. So can we somehow make trash guy angry? Is that another path? I'm guessing here you need a red key card. Here, I really don't know what to do. In the library, you need the purple key card. I'm a little stuck. I don't know what to... Yeah, I think we need to get a red or purple key card, but I don't know where to start. Does anyone have... Does anyone know about this game and where I should start? Because I, I, we could just randomly go around. Like, what area should we start looking in? We should go into... Oh, well, we can do something in the bathhouse. Okay, well, let's check out the bathhouse again. Apparently, we're not done here yet. Let's actually, let's, let's see if we can, like, divert Wolfram in another way. All right, let's see. I'm not talking to you right now. But if I don't talk to you, I can't get through here. Yeah, so I have to talk to you. There are multiple... Oh, this is, uh, this is back here. There are multiple rooms, though. All right, let's first talk to him. Let's see, how are you feeling? Blah, blah, blah. Let's see. Can I get Wolfram to hit the low pipe? Yeah, what if we don't undress, maybe? I don't know. Technically, I cannot let you participate. <laughs> yeah, the, his chest is moving in a weird way. Very strong, though. Hi there. Hmm? What are you waiting for? Do you want to participate now or not? What if we don't participate? Hmm? What are you waiting for? Alright. What if I don't take off my clothes though? What if I what if I don't undress? Is he gonna Oh no locker Oh no locker in this one. Gotta look in a different stall. No locker again. There's a locker in here, but I don't wanna undress. I'm swimming in clothes. Alright, I feel like I have to- There's just no way through this door if you don't undress, so I guess we're undressing. <sighs> Take off our clothes. Wolfram, you sicko. You weirdo. There's this room, but it's locked. Is there any sneaky way into this room? Let's see, before we continue, can we sneak around in any way? I want to be a sneaky boy. This just leads back to this area. That doesn't do anything. Um. Oh. Might be of note. Huh? It stinks. I don't even want to know what's behind that door. I do want to know. Okay, so there's a locked door and there's a private door over here. So that door is locked and very stinky, apparently. And then there is another door over here. Which says private, but I don't know how to get in there. Maybe if we get him, maybe if we start talking to you. And then everyone goes into the shower, but we don't do that. I'm guessing that's going to be the one of the paths. But see, everything in red is important, right? He says that taking a shower is absolutely crucial. What if we don't do that? Does he go anywhere? What if I talk to him? What? You should take a shower too. 
Now, if you would excuse me, I need to report to today's attendance. Just follow the others and meet me back at the main pool. What if I don't? What if I follow you instead? Mm hmm? <laughs> sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. What is he doing in here? He's go he goes to the private room. Oh, there's something. Ah, but there's something there. He opened the door for me. Let's go. All right. He's fast, though. I can outrun him. I'm faster. I want it more. Okay. Lost me? What's this? Let me guess a key card? Purple key card! Let's go! Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Sit down. What's that do? Summer, Summer Lane. Thank you for the 19 gift subs. Holy shit. Okay, so we got a new key card. Now we can go to Hauser. You can grab me. I don't even care. Kill me. See if I care. We're going to Hauser's library, baby. Idiot. You can't take my key card away. At least I hope not. We're going to be another story. Uh, don't hear it. I'm guessing we're going to have to go into Hauser's library before we get another page. Okay. I don't know what that guy was supposed to help me with. Here we go. Guardian, thank you for the 14 months. All right. We still haven't done everything in the bathhouse, but let's go here now. Because I don't... Maybe we need the key to get into the stinky room. Where did we put the key card? <laughs> you don't want to know. You don't want to know. Yeah, one naked guy being chased by a guy in a speedo. All right, so now we can go into both these rooms. Hi there, sir. You don't really help me, but you look kind of cool. So I'll take a screenshot. What is this? Uh, that's one cursed picture, huh? Your music? What is this? Number five. What is this? A weird pedestal. It has some kind of mail slot on it. Maybe that Doku guy knows something about it. Okay, let's ask him. Can you help me with this? Because he walked away last time. Hello. Good, how did all this happen? Good God, how does all this happen? It was really scary, you know that. Don't ever do that again. Wait, is he not going to help me? Despite all this, you made it into the library. How many people manage to do this nowadays? Houcher has moved most of his book up into the attic. This is the same. And lock this place up. But seeing that you're here now and that you've helped me find Gregory, I thought it would be only fair to help you out however I can. I'm not leaving these walls though. Okay, so we're gonna have to find him in multiple positions, I'm guessing. Arthur still might be lurking around here. Okay, so he's now gonna walk somewhere else, probably over here. And then we can talk to him again. Maybe he knows something. Over here, in the walls. Where are you hiding, friend? I need your help. Okay. Oh, there he is! Hi! Give paper crown! Okay, I see. I got an achievement called Birthday Boys. What is this? Is this for me? Look at the crown! You thought of my birthday. But how did you know? Thank you either way. That's so cute. See that thing over there? Yes, I see. I've seen Hauser slide all kinds of documents in there. I don't know, probably anything he deemed extra important or something. Maybe you can find something similar. You do, just put them into that slot. I don't know what will happen, but it can't be that bad if Hauser used it himself, right? Okay, let's see. Do we have lots of insert item of knowledge. Aha. Uh -huh. The red key card. Oh, okay. I see. You need five knowledge to be able to get the red key card. Well, we already got that. We got so much. We have eight knowledge. Okay, so now we can go to even more locations. But first, I want to check out what's back here. I go through here. 
Yes. We, this this door also opens with a purple key card, I'm guessing. So now we can go through the courtyard as well as through another area. Uh, this is not open. You gotta be here too. There, now we need we're gonna get something to open the plug here, or like in every area probably. Um, yeah, I don't think there's anything here. I think it's time for me to to go to. The courtyard had a red key card, and there was another place with a red key card. But let's just go to the courtyard first. Because I think that led... Leads to a whole new area. Let's see. I got an achievement called Hauser's Library. Okay. Complete all paths in Hauser's Library. So that's done too. Let's go to the courtyard. Hi, Casey. Thank you for the 24 months. Holy shit. Now, where are the... Where's the red key card? Bathhouse. It's this way, right? I think. New. It's just a loop. Oh, this is the teleport room. It's the bibliotheque. Oh, here. Yes. Okay. So this is going to lead somewhere. Leave area, sure. Okay, new. Oh, we're back at the start. What is this? Hi. Um. He's very quiet here. Can't even touch this door, excuse me. Open. It's stuck in the rubble. Excuse me? <laughs> what, what the hell? There's nothing here? After all I've been through? Can we even go back? No need to go back outside. But then where do I go? There's no other way to go. Oh, wait, this door's open now? What the fuck? Excuse me? What? I'm being trapped. Oh, uh-oh. Um. I'm in a dark, dark room. The teleporter. I don't wanna. Oh, there's something. There's a crowbar behind here. Interesting. Wait, is this going to the sick ward? We can get that. It's very dark now. All of a sudden. Very quiet, too. This is gonna lead to a bad ending. Robar, thank you. Naked and afraid. Yeah, I hope we put some clothes back on. <laughs> we might still be naked. Who knows? Rolling through the vents, but naked. We're gonna need a flashlight. Okay, so we got the crowbar. Now what do I do with that? This one. Hello? Anyone here? Computer? This is very ominous. Wait, this is just how I get to the teleporter? I don't want to. Oh. Wait, the teleporter's gone! Excuse me. It was a fake teleporter! Hi. Insanely cursed. Um, can I go through here? Uh, there's uh, some way to go. Who is screaming? Is this you, Dr. Joseph? I haven't done anything, I promise. Kind of sounds like him. I don't trust it. It's another one of those weird plugs. Pull. What? It 
It's been a while. A long while. What was I think? A long while of only being able to watch as I went up in flames. I did not seek my counsel any longer. Quite the opposite. They tried to silence me. In the fear they succeeded. But no! You are here. You listen. Um. Okay. Can we now pull out all those plugs? You must understand that I cannot let you off here unless you show me some comprehension. Don't be afraid. I'm not your enemy. Well, <laughs> what if we put the cord back in? Is. Oh, he opened the door. Can't take the teleporter. There he is again. Those cold, marble eyes staring into the darkness. This guy? Blind judge placed before six perpetrators. And you. You shall be his witness. His eyes. What the freak? Um. Oh, hi. Burn? Oh no, we need to do a puzzle. Ah, oh, might be of oh. note. Ah, oh, men of I much. Of much knowledge and oh. wisdom. Always eager to discover new ways of treatment. So much, in fact. That he opened his own library. And well, you saw what happened to him. It's so unfortunate. He was aware of the events, and driven by fear, and the will to protect his collection, he moved as much as he could to somewhere he deemed safe. Present answer? Is this your final answer? Oh. Hmm. No, oh, no, no. I suppose that's a good start, but think again. What? I'm, I'm gonna turn up the volume. I can barely hear this guy. What the fuck? Did I? Does turning up the volume also increase the fucking sensitivity or did, what? Did I accidentally turn up the sensitivity as well? Uh, oh god, it's way too loud now. Okay. Also, the hip hop got turned on. What happened? Um, let's see. We have Nurse. We have Wolfram. We have the Hauser guy. We have Joseph. Wait, is that not Hauser? Oh, that's the Nurse. Or the, the lady from the sick ward. And then you are who now? I don't recognize you. What a sorry creature. You saw for yourself. Doomed to boil okay. for all eternity. And to serve his own flesh is poison to those least deserving. How did he end up like that? Okay. What we already talked about. The voice remains quiet. Hmm. Dear Metatron, she has been with me for so, so many years. Always loyal, but never without fault. I saw her do things, things she shouldn't have done. She was often frustrated. She wanted silence. She wanted solitude. But since all those little suffering mounts around her wouldn't allow them, she went down the wrong path. I, you're talking to me as if I like know every in and out of this story, which I don't, but I appreciate it. Oh, turn. Let's see. There's four different oh, options. She knew how to make us laugh. She knew how to get through to people. A fortunate skill to possess, especially in her profession. The kind of therapy she practiced would seem unnecessary 
and cruel to most, and you wouldn't be wrong to judge her for. But even with those things in mind, she was able to take away some of the pain. Okay, there's I think only one left. Only you. Oh, we don't like to talk about this woman. <laughs> so, so pretty on the outside. Yet his soul was corrupted long before the physical began. I've tried to keep you away from him. Not that I work particularly well. We can only hope that one day he gets what his soul loves. Uh, okay, then you don't like Wolfram? You don't like the pretty boy? Okay, um, so let's see. Can I turn this guy as well? What is this? It reads, Each to their own, yet what good is a broken oath? Okay, so we need to do an order? I don't know what the... I mean, I could do them in the, I could do them in the order that I encounter them, which is one... Um... Two... Three... And then, which one next? Was it Wolfram or was it one of you guys? It was you, four. But it only goes up to four, so I don't really know what. Hmm, I'm not sure. Let's talk to him. It's probably not the answer, but I don't really know what you want. Is this your final answer? Hmm. The order of most. It's a good start, but think again. Can you give me any, any hint at all? Like, I have no clue as to who, how to move forward. This guy is freaking mysterious as heck. But my end settings are messed up. The answer to what, my friend? Okay, um... I, I guess I could turn these. Or maybe... Hmm. But there's also colors. There's red, yellow, green. Wait. Yeah. Wait, red, yellow, green. What's this color? Also, is it like yellow, green? Um, hmm. I think we should, I think we should go through the, through the game and like talk to the plugs, maybe. Let's see if we can do that. Can we go with the teleporter? I can't go with the teleporter. I have to give him an answer. Wait, what? I don't have an answer for you. I already did order of encounter. That did not work. So I can't go out. I, I'm stuck here until I get the until I get this puzzle right. I'm confused. <laughs> Let's see. You. Do I need to do like their? I don't know. They, they're like level of level in the in the clinic. Like, I don't know how to group them. There's no other way to go, right? There's something with oaths. Can I just leave? What if I leave? Oh! Can you hear them? Uh huh. Ancient words set in stone to serve as guidance for those that follow. See? Study them closely. Alright, maybe this will provide us the answer. I see a number. Aha. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. We just need to find them. Okay. One on the beard guy. Wait, excuse me. One on the beard guy. Two. Oh. I will apply for the benefit of the sick, all measures, and only those required. Avoiding those twin traps of overtreatment and th therapeutic nihilism. Who is this? Okay. Then we need to figure out. This feels like the. The nurse. But they have to be grouped, right? Anne and the other one? We could do Anne and also the other. Because we have to group them together. And what's this? I will respect the hard won scientific gains of those physicians in whose who step I walk. Gladly share such knowledge as is mine, Hauser. But those who are to follow. Okay, so that one is easy. One is Hauser. And then, let's see. One is, I, I, let's just go through all of them before we start going, filling in stuff. Um, 
Yeah, two might be the lady that sent me to the electrocution ward. I will remember that there is art to medicine as well as science. And that warmth, sympathy, and understanding may outweigh the surgeon's knife or the chemist's drug. Ah, Wolfram? That warm sympathy. Could this be Anne? Is this the electricity lady? This might be the electricity lady. I'm not sure. But Anne, yeah, I don't know. Okay. But how the fuck do we group them? Uh, what's this? Nothing. The taser lady. Uh, oh, here's four. I will prevent disease whenever I can, for prevention is preferable to cure. This has to be the... Wait. This has to be... This is not Wolfram, right? Prevention... Maybe? Did he say something about prevention? I don't remember that. Um, this is extremely confusing. It could be the... Joseph guy. Sour is definitely not none of these. None of these is sour. So what the fuck are we supposed to do? Okay. Let's see. So one is definitely Hauser. But we know that. Let's let's go through what we know. We know that um you're not one. You are one. So you're one. Check. Then two was the Hygiene and sports are four might be this guy and then you are two, right? Because there was kindness. This is two and then you're three, but then who what's the rest? Do we just leave them leave you at one and leave you at one like what do we do with the people that don't? Line up with any of this Do we just Maybe we just do four for this guy because he likes to prevent stuff as well. And then what do we do with this dude? <laughs> like this dude was... I don't understand. Because you were... This is very difficult. What the fuck? Is this your final answer? Hmm. Suppose it's a good start. This fucking sucks. But four for the... Because the, uh, maybe, maybe the chef is also four because he doesn't actually really do anything. He just like gives people food. So maybe he wants to prevent diseases. I don't know. I don't know why everyone would be four though. That seems a little much, but let's try it, I guess. Good. Good? Okay. Well, never mind then. <laughs> okay. That is true. That is, feels a bit, um, or a bit random. Okay. So... It was people that want to prevent diseases was Wolfram, but they were all the same. Joseph, as well as Sour, the guy that gave like terrible food to people. His mantra was preventing diseases. I don't know how that makes any sense. Hauser was easy. And then you had her who wanted to help people and you who were like, hey, I want to be kind to people, even though you electrocuted them anyway. Okay. Now where do we go? Shh. I can hear someone up ahead. Oh. Oh no 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 no. This is not good. I'm afraid you have no choice. Be careful. I'm counting on you. What? Oh. I'm sneaky. What the fuck is this? Excuse me. What the hell? Are you walking up on the ceiling?
I'm confused. Back here? Was all of that even real? Leave area. Oops, I should have probably listened to what he was what he had to say. You're not quite sure what just happened. Something was talking to you. Something great, mighty, and according to its own words, apparently omnipresent. It knew everything that had happened here, but how? You take a deep breath and press forward. Oh, new area. The patient hall. Okay. Go back, we didn't see it. I don't want to see that. <laughs> Whatever that was, it was gonna kill me. Okay. New area. Is the head bob turned back on? Why does the head bob get turned on? Why does the why do the why do the settings reset themselves after you change area? That's ridiculous. Excuse me. Um This is a fancy looking area. Yeah, the sensitivity is very fucked up. I will clinic. What? You move very fast. I'm just moving fast. Um. Can I talk to you? This is not a good time. Come back when my shift is over. Just helping everyone. My shift is still not over. Okay, I'm gonna have to wait for your shift to be over. In the meantime, I'll look around. He's zooming. Do I look like I can talk right now? No, no, no. Don't worry about it. What's this? Take Ast. This is Astrid. Take Helena's. We. Who's Helena? Astrid. Schwester. <laughs> Isn't that sister? In the German. Nothing else here. Excuse me. The nurse it's like what you call a nurse helena is that is this helena Ooh. looks like her schedule okay i see it's pretty busy but you got a break today at 10 p.m this clock shows about 10 p.m that checks out okay go 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 talk to her wait oh but this is not this clock He doesn't want to talk. Talk to me! Okay, I need to... Oh. Turquoise key card. Okay, we need to check... Uh... How do I get this clock to be activated? PM. It's, it's stuck. The hour handle is stuck. Clock starts about 10 p.m. Hmm. That checks out. Check our schedule. 10 p.m. Maybe I just gotta wait. Does the hour move? Oh, the hour does move. Wait, does it? Let's see. You're stuck. <laughs> nah. Is it moving? Lady, are you okay? <laughs> you have a moment now? Why are you, why are you cross-eyed? Is this gonna move the hour handle? Or not. not it does not okay 5 p.m that can't be right it's already dark out oh although i could turn the hands a bit ah uh, here we go 10 p.m nurse is so busy she won't notice anyway i did it you are it's your it's your break isn't it 10 hello oh god she's broken oh no Lady! Lady, please! Um, I think this is bad. Uh-oh. Oh no, what am I supposed to do? Lady! Fuck, what if I walk away? I, I didn't even do anything! She just got stuck by herself! What if I get out of her range? Maybe she'll fix herself? 
It's not 10 yet. It is 10. I literally moved the clock. Ah, uh, come on. She's stuck. I think she's... Oh. <laughs> Never mind. She's fine. I guess that means it's break time. He could... Oh. Hi. <sighs> Good lord, there's so much work to do lately. Apparently Astra doesn't deem it necessary to show up to work anymore. And I'm struggling my ass off trying to keep up with all the patients. Feels like I'm the only one doing any proper work at this point. Have you seen what happened to the others? No? They've lost their minds, I'm telling you. Oh, and I also need two special medications for my patients. But I've got absolutely no time to go and fetch them. Do you think you could? I could help you out. Yes, my dear. I know you're technically not qualified, but... I really don't care at this point. Here, take my master key card and go get them. Let's go. Thank you very much, dear. All right, she's back to work. Leave me back here once you've got the meds. All right. In the meantime, I should probably get back to work. Crazy. All right. Leave area. Poor Helena. Darkness engulfs you. You can hear faint creaking of brittle wood and beams in the distance. Why would they store medicine in this place? Uh-oh. Where are we going? Basement? The old ward, of course. Where this is Sunny Meadows. Oh, where they do human experiments. We're in Bloodborne now. The dilapidated looking place. Take a few matches. It's gonna get real dark soon. Light. Uh huh. Oh, this is gonna help me find where I've already been. I don't have anything to light it with. I do, though. I literally just did. There's This guy is really self absorbed, huh? He's got so many. These doors look different from the others. He's got so many statues of himself, the weirdo. Could be interesting. Can't go on. It's way too dark. Damn it, that was my last ma- Oh, Jesus. Hi. I should try to find some more matches. Are you kidding me? Fuck. All right, I see. Darkness mechanic all of a sudden. I can't go this way, huh? I don't have any matches. Dang it. All right, I wasted all my matches on meaningless lamps. I just saved it. Oh, I didn't mean to. I thought that was just a regular door. Ooh, piece of shit. <laughs> God damn it. Hopefully the lights are still on. What the heck? The old ward. That matches would be infinite. I mean, it said few matches, right? That makes sense. Please tell me they're still all lit. Hmm. Okay, so it resets. All right, maybe I should only light it when it doesn't allow me to continue walking. Oh, okay. Well, it doesn't allow you to continue walking every time. So I have to light all of these. Okay, I see, I see. But, I mean, I can go these ways. I don't need these. Let's see. Maybe I need to be sparing with my matches. Uh, this is where I came from. This way. I can't go through here, right? These doors look different. But now I should still have... Wait, so no matter what you do, this is going to be your last match? Okay. Well, fuck me then. Oh. 
So I should have just lit everything. Noted. I, I want to get through a vent here. I want to get over here. You can see the matches right on this. Matches are here. Wait, no, that's not a match. Never mind. I thought it was a match. Just a countertop. Uh huh. Just let's go. Okay. But then I want to light all these back here as well. Because it seems like these are free. And we can see better. like half it's like mostly puppet combo style art but i like the first person ish puppet combo often does third person this makes it feel more immersive all right where do we go so it honestly looks like besides the brick this looks very similar to the to the modern ward interesting and go on i think those are the meds i need it took the meds study hockey did you just say hello joseph it is me what the hell Joseph is the evil mastermind. What the fuck was that? It was like a walking MRI scanner, kind of. Or a rolling. Oh, oh hi there. What the fuck? Excuse me. Oh, thank you. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, can I take it? You're not Joseph. And she got real sad. I'm sorry. What the fuck? Excuse me. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not Joseph. Oh, I, I know where Joseph is, though. I can tell you. I can tell him to come over here. Um, can't go through anywhere. I needed two medicine, though, didn't I? I only have one. Do we need more? Are you okay? You know you can just keep living your life like you used to. You don't need me. You don't. You're a strong, independent MRI machine. The iron lung monster. There's always someone who starts questioning your responsible actions first. This time it was Astrid. And although she had good intentions, it ended so much worse for her. I see. Was that Astrid? Is Astrid the amalgamation? What the hell? That's the way back. Leave area. I got the meds. Got it. You want him? You chill out, lady. You find those meds yet? I think so. All right. Have a break. I can't move the clock. I can't help you if you. Okay, I do need to. All right. Never mind then. Oh, I do need to. Wait, what? Do I need to go to the other side? Is there another one? Darkness and Gulf Shoot. I'm confused. Going to play the Mortuary Assistant. Are they still doing updates for the Mortuary Assistant? I don't think so anymore. I mean, if they do another, like... They didn't do an Easter event, I think. They did a Halloween event and then a Christmas event as well. No major updates. I mean, I know the dev has been working on other things as well, probably. Okay, this sucks. Now we have to go... It's not going to be in here, right? Don't tell me it's gonna be in here. So annoying. Will I play the forest again? You mean Sons of the Forest or the original The Forest? Uh, what the fuck? Again. 
working on another game probably going to be related to mortuary assistant again because all of his games have been related to each other sons of the forest i probably won't play it for a while i don't know sons of the forest was fun um but i'm kind of done with it didn't really i mean it's getting updates so maybe soon or maybe at some point there will be enough content to come back He's almost done with a new ending for the Mortuary Assistant. Ooh, that's nice. Um, did I just use my last match? Okay, so I don't know if I'm supposed to do this again or if I messed something up. I'm confused. Will I play Apparition more? Did you watch the last video? Because I said that I wouldn't. He's working on a bullet hell shooter. Excuse me. Uh... Will I play more Phasmo? No, I'll never play Phasmophobia ever again. Fuck that game. Uh, I think those are the- So I didn't do this right! What even are you talking about? Some stupid ghost hunting game? That's for kids. That's for babies. Ghosts aren't even real, man. Oh, we're probably playing tomorrow because the weekly is uh, gonna update. <laughs> Let's tell CJ. Alrighty, I don't. I'm confused. I like the atmosphere here, but it's a little slow. Because I, I mean, mostly because I just left. I shouldn't have done that. Oh wait. What? Isn't this the medicine? This looks. Did I break it? Did I bug out the game? Uh-oh. Huh? Refused? I don't know what happened. Confusing. This is... What? This is what I need, no? The fuck? What am I supposed to do? This is where I came from. Maybe I got one of them and I need to go to the other side. Maybe that's it. Maybe I already got this one and I think then I need now need to go to a different area. Yes, maybe. I, I definitely this seems like stuck somehow. So it's either bugged or I've already done what I needed to do here. So let's go back to the other area. This is this is not it. I, I did open the door, the study door. That's how I got here in the first place. Yeah, let's, I guess I just leave. There's two, unless, if it is here, then it's bugged anyway, so we need to leave. Door. Leave. There was no other locked door as far as I know. Wait, so can we, maybe on the other side, there's another place we can go this way? I don't think I even went this way. Yeah, okay, there we go. Alright, so this is where we get the second one. I see. I understand. Finally, some more fresh air. You could have sworn that typical hospital smell has gotten worse over time. Although this yard houses another unpleasant smell. Just faintly, but it is noticeable. Courtyard again? The trash yard? What was the other one then? <laughs> Why was the trash man not walking around in the trash yard? Excuse me? Seems like that will be his home. Uh, this does, it's looked exactly the same. Plastic mool. A guide on how to dispose of trash. Green is bio waste. Yellow is plastic waste. And black or brown is for glass. Seems simple enough, okay. Let me guess, we're gonna have to do that? Any trash around? Every door. There's trash behind here. There's yellow trash. Aha, I see. Those are the yellow trash cans. The ultimate German game. Recycling your trash or sorting out your trash. They're like countries. Doesn't Japan have like 17 different trash categories that you have to like 
sort out everything. We mostly just do plastic and like bio waste. Plastic, bio waste, and like anything else. Oh, hi there. Hungry trash collector. Oh, it's you again. Don't mind me. I'm just having a good meal right now. How about you? You're looking for medicine. My, what a coincidence. They are doing some construction work on the storage area right now. And it's really easy to get in via the scaffolding. You can actually reach that scaffolding, that is. I might be able to help you out, though. For a price, of course. Ask price. Uh, I knew you couldn't resist. I already helped you before, so apparently they're dumping some super crinkly packaging around here lately. Not exactly nutritious, but it's sometimes you got to appreciate a treat like that. Get me some of that and we'll be on our way. Crinkly packaging. Sounds like plastic. Oh, and you'll need this key to open the gr those green doors. Uh-huh. That's where they keep the good stuff. Thank you. Trash key. Okay. Do we need to... Is doors? He just wants some crunchy stuff. Oh, this is gonna be a freaking maze, huh? Back and thank you for the 19 and nay, thank you for the 7. Also, again, it fucked up the goddamn settings, you piece. That's... what is this? Egg from green bin. This is gonna be bio waste, right? That's probably not what he wants. That's bio waste, yeah. I, I, he wants yellow for sure, right? He wants plastic. Which is over here. I would like this. Wait, I can't take it! You saw He's gonna be angry. He's gonna be like, that's not plastic. That's bio shit. Well, whatever. I'll have to give it to him. I can't put it back. I'm sorry, my friend, but I got you... Mildly dissatisfied trash collector. Not quite what I re requested, but I appreciate it. Pretty good nonetheless. All right, let's go right this way. Okay, never mind. He didn't care. Gonna lead to the bad ending. He did all this work just to get the bad ending from the trash collector. Also, your ass is right on eye level for me. This feels awkward. Uh, how have you been lately anyway? Yeah, we got to fill the... Have you met Chef, Chef Sour yet? You understand why I prefer now eating this so-called his not eating his so-called soup now? Yes. Face full of ass. He is very tall. You know, I've been hearing very strange noises around here lately. Like distorted screaming and weeping. Sounds absolutely horrible. Have you heard those too? Not really. Maybe I'm just going mad after all. Wouldn't surprise me at this point. All right, here we go. Thank you. They didn't want to do an animation. Good luck. I wonder what happens if you give them the right trash. Like if he's just gonna give you something. Maybe. Oh, there it is. Well, that was easy. I know what you're talking about. That does sound cursed. Oh no! What? He got killed! <laughs> what happened? Feels bad, man. Rip trash, man. Am I gonna be chased now? This felt like it was way too easy anyway. Uh. Oh? I guess I can just leave? Did the bio trash kill him? I got both the medicine. I don't know what that was all about, but here you go. She's taking a break at five? Hi. Oh, this is fantastic. Thank you so much, darling. These will come in very handy. Now I think we both need a little break. Come join me in the park. Take a little breather. The park's over here. All of them are just gonna die. Rip the patience. 
What the fuck are you doing? Just gonna kick down the door. Oh, here we go. You have been a great help to Helena. So she decided it's time for both of you to take a break. She unlocks the door to the park and you follow her outside. All right, new last area potentially. I don't I mean, there's probably gonna be more, another spooky area. The Heilwald Park. We haven't done any looping in a while. I've, I have no idea what happened to Astrid. Was, or was Astrid the machine? Maybe. Didn't Astrid hate Joseph though? So why would Astrid want to be with Joseph? I don't think so. Because Astrid wrote like those papers that were debunking Joseph, right? Jesus, what a weather. It's been raining like this for days. With no end in sight. It's kind of soothing though, don't you think? Have you seen that massive bulky building over there? That's the new dental facility commissioned by Dr. Randall. Looks more like a giant torture chamber to me though. I mean, it doesn't even have windows. It really made this look as uninviting as possible. I think that building has truly ruined this park's mood for me. I used to sit and talk here with my patients. But no one really wants to come here anymore. Completely understandable, of course. Especially because of those weird ventilation shafts that they have installed. Uh, convenient. They're incredibly noisy. I don't even know what releasing all the steam in the first... What is releasing all the steam in the first place? Uh, maybe we'll check them out. And go through. I mean, it looks like a pretty nice park. It's just a little dark, like in the middle of the night. Uh, Highwall Dental Clinic? A whole new world? Leave area question mark? What's this vent over here? Well, I guess <laughs> a whole new place to explore. This can't be as big as the previous one. <laughs> the expansive conc concrete monstrosity that is the new dental facility towers above you. You're not sure if this is a good idea, but you do not see any other way. So you step inside. Okay, dental facility. This is the true terror zone. This is everyone's nightmare. I've never been scared of the dentist. I don't really, I don't really know how you can be scared of the dentist unless you have, I feel like the only way you can be scared of the dentist is if you have such terrible dental hygiene that they have to do like painful procedures on you all the time. I've never had a cavity. I've never had anything. Do you have an appointment? You think you don't, huh? Well, let me check. Aha, uh -huh. looks like you do have an appointment right about now. Excuse me. Isn't that curious? Yes, it was issued by Dr. Randolph himself. Quick dental examination, evaluation, and rep, rep, reparation. Please have a seat in the waiting room. Nurse Sa Sabine will be with you, will be right with you. Is that, that's Joseph, right? Or am I, is this Randolph or Joseph? I keep confusing them. Ooh. This look actually kind of nice. But it's also genetic. I mean, it could be. I don't know. I've just been lucky. Hi there. What the f- You look like Anne, but fucked up. Hello, hello. I'm Nurse uh, Sabine. How- But you may call me Sabine. You're here for your dental examination, evaluation, and reparation, I presume. As issued by Dr. Randall. Dude, this is cursed. <laughs> of course you are. And I've kept you waiting for long enough, so let's get going. Hey, Lazy, thank you for the two. Freaking walk with pride strides. Or proud strides, I should say. But it doesn't rhyme that way. Haha, uh -huh, don't mind that. 
We're still working on better local anesthetics. Oh god. Sounds like they didn't use any at all though. Don't worry about it. What the fuck? Hey man, what's up? Uh-oh. Oh, please ignore all the clutter. This building is very new and still somewhat under construction. I'm sure you've noticed already. But of course, it's all for the most efficient betterment of our patients. I don't believe it at all. Here we are! Please have a seat and we'll start the procedure. This is freaking cursed. What the? Uh, I'm taking a screenshot of your absolutely cursed face. Sit down. Oh boy. Marvelous! So, as you might already know, we will begin by examining your dental condition. Actually, it's more like a cardio thing for your teeth and jaw. After all, strong pearly whites are so important. Let me grab the equipment. I don't know why I sat down here. This seems like a bad idea. It's cardio for my teeth. What does that mean? Uh, what the fuck is that? The landfall! I see it fits like a glove. Any discomfort? Of course not, haha. -ha. Right, so this thing will basically apply a lot of pressure to your jaw and in turn your teeth. Did you know that the jaw houses the strongest muscle in the entire body? Amazing, isn't it? And surprising as well. You should have no problem resisting this thing. All right, one more thing. Here we go. What the fuck? Ah! We'll start with 30 pounds of pressure. Jesus. I did. Oh my God. 224 pounds. I'm dead. What the fuck? Uh, 418 pounds. Not my teeth. 612 pounds? Help! What the fuck? There's a whole freaking car on my teeth? Dude, you made it. I feel like my teeth didn't make it. Oh, but we made it. We made a bit of a mess here, didn't we? Ha ha. But that's all right. Next up is the reparation procedure but I was told dr. Randolph would see to that personally so have a nice day dr. Randolph will be here soon what the fuck ow my teeth hurt 800 pounds of pressure on your teeth what the fuck are you Oh my god, excuse me. She's still looking at me. The wickedness when he has me cool. Trying to make heart up in his field. It is a curse. A sickness. What the fuck? A sickness that afflicted everyone and everything. Including you. And including me. The music? What do I gotta do? Can I kill him? What the fuck? Hi. Um, you look a bit... bad. What the fuck? Can I go? I can't escape. Oh, here! teleport do i have to bait him inside there come over here oh he can't go in here i'm just i did it 
I did it. <laughs> I'm a genius. But my teeth, though. Wait, what? <laughs> is that the? Is that the? Down he goes. For one last time. What? Is it? Down the loophole? I'm so confused. <laughs> the music is great though, what the fuck? Was it me all this time? This feels like the type of game that would go like, Oh my god, we're back at the beginning again! It looks like the guy from the start. I was assuming it would just roll straight into credits, but... The high wall loop wall. I'm not quite sure I understand the story. I didn't really like the gameplay. It was very unique like this. Like, I mean, I still missed one story bit, so I'm not sure how important that was. The end got extremely confusing though. Like I, I really liked the beginning where it was just all like wild and wacky and crazy. At the end, it was like, I don't know. It expected you to understand more of the story than I did. Like, there's got to be an ex a, ex a story explained story out there somewhere, but I didn't really get it. Like, there was a, a, a hospital where everyone slowly went crazy and the people that were supposed to help didn't actually help but became, like, evil. I guess that's the main story. The main story is just everyone slowly became possessed and became evil. But yeah, that was a very interesting uh, style of gameplay with this like looping uh, to, to figure out which thing. It was basically like a try every option until you have seen it all kind of game. So wonder what I missed. So here we go. Visit report time played one hour and nine minutes. Um, I don't. Huh? <laughs> Is time convoluted? Because I'm pretty sure we played it for almost three hours. But anyway, loopholes used nine, 19. Knowledge items 8 of 9, neglected patient encounters 0 out of 3. We did find a neglected patient. Why? Huh? Well, that was the guy that was that wanted to a oh, glass of water. Birthday celebrated 2, trash collector's thoughts 0 of 5. Trash collector alive? No. Golden toilets 1 of 3, overall completion 50%? What do you mean 50%, my guy? <laughs> all right, so you need... Wait, how is this 15%? We did we did eight of nine. I guess all of these count equally. So it's missing five here, three there, two there. So the total sum of things that I missed is... I don't even know what this is. I feel like this is just talking to him, probably. So this is two, seven, ten. So yeah, it's ten here. And then I have 11 total. But, oh, and he died. So that's also one. All right. Anyway, very interesting game. Very, never really played anything like this. I definitely enjoyed it. And I hope you did over on YouTube as well. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you understand the story. Because I definitely did not. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you just like it, dislike it. And if you want to join, lovely gamers over in chat. You can join us over at twist.tv. Click the link in the description down below. Thank you so much. See you in the next one. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Oh, baby. Alrighty, well that was, I don't understand the ending there at all, but that's just, I guess that's the way it is. Obviously we could continue playing, but I'm, I don't know. I, I feel like maybe the ending if you like play more would be more interesting, but I don't know. It didn't really hook me at the end. At the end it was kind of like, yeah, I'm done with it. Uh, so let's move on. We don't have enough time to play the year wall because that game is slightly too long, but there's another game that is way shorter that I also want to check out. It's very weird looking. There's also... Wait a minute. How long is this game? I kind of want to try... The... Uh, let me see if I can find this game fast. This game looked very interesting. Oh, yeah, this one. Oh, it's on Steam? This looks... It might not become a YouTube video, but it looked fucking crazy, and I want to try it out. Yeah, this one. It's a free game on Steam. It's called The Suits Have Gone Mad. How much is it to install? It's one gigabyte. We can install this. It, it's a game. It was... When I was playing Shadows of Doubt today, this game was, like, on my mind all the time because I, I saw a few snippets of it. Um, because in Shadows of Doubt, there's, like, this time of the day where all of the people just put on their suits and start running around like crazy. So it kind of reminded me of this game. So I want to... Let's see. It's downloading. It's almost done. One gigabyte's not too much. Little UXC, thank you for the sub.
Let's see. Okay, stream might lag a little bit because I'm downloading a game, but it's going to be done in a sec here. And then we hop in. There's still, there's so many games I have to play, but I want to try this one out. It's, it's only a demo, but I just, it looked very weird and wacky. It only has six reviews. Oh, it came out two days ago. It's from Blank Dream Studio. Oh, they made an uninvited guest. Wait, I love that game. Wait, wait, I love this dev makes great games. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, let's see. The suits have gone mad. Here we go. So I don't really know anything about this, besides that it looks really it looked really wild and wacky. Uh so let's just hop in. I don't know I don't know if this is how this is gonna go. Let's just check it out. Options. Uh VSync, yes please. Windowed full screen. Sure. Apply video settings. Alright, here we go. The suits have gone mad. Chapter one. I don't know if I had a guess was really cool. Okay. Lake and Whitley Innovations Introductory Video. <laughs> Welcome to your new lifestyle. This presentation will teach you about the five P's of our company. First, presentable. All employees are required to wear a formal black suit at all times. Two, punctual. Employees are required to complete a minimum of 60 hours work per week. No excuses. Three, productivity. It is an obligation to report peers who are lazy. Report any suspected employees through the email service immediately. Four, pause. Everyone needs a break. Pause from your work. Take a maximum of 15 minutes away from your desk throughout the day. What the fuck? Five, perform. This is already anxiety inducing. We employ because we see potential. Achieve what we ask and one day you will be the one in an elegant white suit. Promotions available after a minimum of five years. Thanks for joining the team. I look forward to your efforts. Leonardo Blake, CEO. The suits have gone mad. <laughs> By Blank Dream Studio, which has also made an uninvited guest, which is a really cool game. Uh, they make some very unique styled games, so I'm, I'm expecting great things. Chapter one, ordinary routine. Uh, kind of gives me Stanley Parable vibes, but it's in black and white. I'm very late today. Um, it's best to take the elevator to my office as quick as possible. Visitor sign here. I guess I'm not a visitor. Please return after reading. Head up to your office. Uh, there's no one here. Uh, on break, back in 10 minutes. You're taking all of your break right now? Uh, it's gonna be slippery. Welcome to the trial period for the optical delivery system. Report any technical issues or adverse symptoms that may occur on daily use. Can I... <laughs> I, was gonna... I got an achievement called read the sign. Wait, I'm dead? <laughs> Excuse me. I had to try. Wait, come on, man. I don't want to watch the video again. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, all right. <laughs> the video of shame. Come on, man. Can I skip it? I can't even skip it. I have to watch again. What the fuck? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> you hate to see it. I need to be taught the lessons again. Well, yeah, I'm going to sue them. <laughs> Hi, YouTube. What the fuck? I have to try. I get there's achievements in this game already. This is free, by the way. There's ten achievements. Okay. All right, come on. Press the space bar. I'm pressing enter. I'm pressing E. Escape. Or oh, maybe I can skip through it. No, I can't. It will brainwash me eventually. I mean, this does make me not want to do too many endings if I'm gonna have to watch this every time. Motions after a minimum of five years. Sixth P is pathetic. All right. I love the... Interesting, a uh, black and white game. I don't think I've ever played a black and white game. Or, I, I mean, Limbo, I guess, but not in this, like, just regular black and white style. 
All right, now I'm not gonna fall this time. <laughs> Leonardo Blake, the man who started it all. Leonardo Blake, yeah, yeah, I'm very late. Leonardo Blake hails from a small suburb just outside the city, living an above average school life and achieving the Distinguished Student Award at the young age of 14. Blake attended the prestigious Chetley University after receiving a full scholarship. Blake graduated with honors and dove straight into the insurance industry with major success. Even after all of Blake's successful ventures, he felt as though his creativity was not being utilized. Blake took a step away from the insurance industry to begin a brand new journey with Blake and Whitley Innovations. Isn't the insurance industry like one of the most scummy bullshit industries of all time? Like literally all they're trying to do is just not pay people stuff they need for healthcare and, and stuff. The world was looking dull. Mr. Blake set out to change this. Entrepreneurs Union. Blake joined by his university friend, Jacob, was joined by his university friend, Jacob Whitley, formed a tone innovation business, aiming to introduce the world to a brand new eye-catching tone tones. Together, they released the infamous Moon Gray Tone, which became the most, became the most widely used tone in the world in as little as five months. What's a tone? I guess a music tone, the amazing or like a ringtone, the amazing duo followed up with a collection of tones that have quickly overtaken a majority of market of the market to make Blake and Whitley Innovations the largest tone design and distribution company in history. Blake and Whitley Innovations operates in 17 locations, distributing over 1 million tones to the world daily. Oh, color tones. But why is it black and white then? <laughs> I went from operating out of a garage to a high rise in a month. Leonardo Blake. All right. Seems like we are, uh, already know a lot about this guy. Take the elevator. I'm, I'm going to be super late. Good morning, employee. One eight zero four 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 T O M blue. You look cursed as hell. Is that me? Nice music. <laughs> oh, baby. Love the elevator music. <laughs> Tones are the scaling from black to white, and colors are separate. I see. They have created perfect black and white. How long is this elevator ride? All right, well, gotta be late for work. I'm gonna get fired. Um, oh, the five Ps. Punctual. Employees are required. Yes, we know this. Um... Know the difference. Employee, respect your executives. Executives, know the difference. Okay, we need to respect the white suits. The observer is always watching. Excuse me. Uh, productivity is an obligation to report employees who are lazy. Oscar and Jackson, team supervisor. I don't think I can go this way. I don't think I'm supposed to be here since this is already the team supervisor and I'm probably a little baby bitch. Um... You know, I'm gonna go to my office if I can find it. Rumple of paper. Cancelled! Meet Mr. Blake! Executive sued number three. Tickets start at $400. Only grant granted to employees who have completed their weekly hours. Oh, what the hell? You're currently 176 minutes late. Get to your office immediately. Consequences will follow shortly. Uh, hi there. What the hell? Everyone looks the exact same? You are absolutely cursed. What the frick? This is terrifying. I can be this successful from starting in a garage. What's if I can be this successful, what's stopping you? Money spent on a break money spent on break time today. One million. <laughs> I see. Dude, just shaming people and not taking breaks. I haven't seen Parlos this morning, have you? No? Why are you talking to me? I'm going to my office. I'm gonna get super fired. Employee of the month. Let me guess, it's all the same guy. Yep. <laughs> it's all the exact same guy. Oh, it's different guys, but they look the exact same. Okay. Um, hi there. Oh. Good day to you, Mr. Blue. Good day to you, Mr. White or Black. I don't know. Sometimes I wish the world was more than black and white. Interesting. Um, hello? Where's my office or my cubicle? What did you say? I always start my day by checking my emails. Oh, this is, I have a fancy, wait, I have a fancy computer. I am a senior innovator. Look, 
look at that. I'm a fancy boy. Uh, check through my emails. Lake and Whitley email service. Good morning, Theo. You have six messages. Can't move this around. A delivery confirmed. The order of your company issued new hire package has been processed in our facilities. Please allow up to five business days for delivery. Details of package below. One definition of success. A Leonardo Blake auto autobiography. Uh, Blake and Whitley office accessories. Mega pack. Trials beginning for new position. To whom it may concern as many late penalty notice. Oh, God. To whom it may concern as many may know. Co-founder and chief of innovation. Jacob Whitley has mysteriously been missing for over two months. As sad as it may be, it has been decided to... Uh, officially conduct an initial interview for a new chief of innovation you will be contacted by your department supervisor if we believe you fit the requirements for this role good luck to all candidates tone review q3 hey theo i have finished adding the final graphs and deliverables to the tone review last night all that is left now is to get approval signature from parlov if you could do this asap thanks liam c senior tone innovator Removed by moderation services. This message was automatically flagged by the moderation service and has been removed. Satisfied customers lead to satisfied profits. Daily inspirational quotes. Never be content with the bar. Always shoot above the bar. Avoid getting still. Still bread goes to the trash. If you find you are pleased with your work, then you aren't working hard enough. <laughs> what? What's my late penalty? Do employees 18044. EOM Blue. The surveillance system has observed that you arrived in your office at 10 10 a.m. It is required for all employees to start work by 7 05 a.m. at the latest. A strike has been issued to your employee record. As this is your third strike, your next pay will be docked by 50%. This PC is now on restricted access until review. It has been deemed that this issue is not available for appeal and may not be discussed with co workers. Under Employee Code of Conduct, Rule 53.4. Be punctual next time. Dude! Meaning reminder. I'm clicking it, but it's not... Oh, there. This is a schedule, scheduled email from Explanner about an upcoming date on your calendar. Q4 tone concept meetings with executives. Today at 1 p.m. Conference room 34... 34... 31. The notes app will have a to-do list from what I should do. Okay. Virtual assistant provided by Explanner. The in-house time management system from Blake and White Whitley Innovations. Okay, I did everything. I got some notes. Oh, this is my to-do list. Innovator Studio. What the fuck? Get Parlov's signature. Parlov should be in his office, located past the elevators. Converse with three fellow employees. Walk up to the employees and listen to what they say. Create a presentation. Use Presentomatica to quickly build a presentation. Buy a refreshment. Vending machines sell my favorite drink. Browser, access to multiple programs have been restricted due to multiple inter infractions of company policy. Time until access restrictions are lifted 14 days. Hey. Wait, I can't even do my work though. Oh. I'm doing Presentomatica. Faster than ever before. Preparing a slight generator for a Q4 tone concept meeting. Are you doing it for me? Select an opening slide. Oh, here we go. <laughs> this is good old I'm gonna do I'm gonna do color pencils that seems fitting generating slides what the fuck oh here we go successful tones this is ridiculous <laughs> I'm making a powerpoint uh lush gray midterm silver under I actually like this this is way too much text this is like the worst powerpoint you could possibly make rule number one not too much text Rule number two, have clear diagrams. This is like the clearest diagram ever. It's like the color is next to the name. It's perfect. <laughs> I better get paid for this. Uh, select slide. Introducing the newest tone. So what's next? You know what? I'm doing this. I'm going full like, oh, what is, what's going on here? Kind of slide. Uh, what the, that tone is unlike anything I've ever seen. Rein it's blue. Slight generation error. There's color. Oh. What the fuck? Oh god, what have I done? I've generated color. Um. Excuse me. Hello?
I broke it. I broke the game. I hear talking. There's color now. This is. This is. Uh. What? Presentation finalized. File successfully uploaded to Portable Drive. Thank you for using Presentomatica. That dream again. I dreamed of color. I don't even remember finishing the presentation. So I don't know if this is true. It's uploaded, so I can't do much to fix it now. But I've heard it from some like rep reputable and that tone. What was that? From some like, oh, come on. It must be all in my head. I'm trying to talk here. Uh, that's a task done. I can check my notes on the PC if I forgot the other tasks. You're in interrupting me. Okay, we need to do more tasks. But I don't know if this is true, but apparently before color television, uh, when there was black only black and white television, people used to dream in black and white as well. People started dreaming in color or like, People started dreaming in or people started exclusively dreaming in color when color television was included. People used to dream all the time in black and white. I, I, I don't know if that's like a true fact, but it's one of those fun factoids that I've heard here and there. Anyway, we need to get Parlov's signature. Because I've never dreamed in black and white, but apparently it used to happen. At least if, if the fact is supposed to be believed. It's false but funny what what is do you have a source on that because my i mean i have source is like a local it's the, it's called the quest calendar which is like the a calendar with fun factoids that uh i get every year because they got fun factoids on them so i have a source do you have a source debunking my source because if you don't then i think i'm right anyway uh where's pavlov is he over here Pavlov? Pavlov? Pavlov! Here we go. Hi. What the fuck? Good morning, employee Theo Blue. Parlov will no longer be working with us. We have decided to let him go due to significant breaches of company policy. Investigations are underway, identifying possible accomplices of Mr. Parlov. I hope you have been keeping your nose clean, Mr. Blue. Is I see some blood on the wall. I believe you were needing Parlov to sign off on a tone review. My signature will be more than sufficient. Sure, I guess. Also, I hope you are prepared for your meeting this afternoon that is all in the 19 oh leave in the 1940s and 1950s many people in the united states appear to have thought they dreamed in black and white for example middleton blah 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 or for example middleton middleton found that 70 percent of 777 or 277 college sophomores reported rarely or never seeing colors in their dream see i mean I don't know, we're onto something. Gary has never gone into serious trouble like this before. I mean, he literally just got fucking killed. That's a task done. I could check my notes on the PC. Okay. I need to talk to people, right? You guys want to talk to me? Um, hi. Don't look at me like that. What the fuck? Game is cool. Really weird. Is this a co-op game? <laughs> Oh, promotions never seem to come by. Yeah, this is actually the new ghost hunting game. It's from the developers of Phasmophobia. You might have heard of it. Leonardo Blake is a name that will be remembered for eternity. I'd give up an arm to have a day in a white suit. <laughs> All right, well, I did everything. I talked to three people. Wasn't that a task? It's always good to see how other employees are going. Can I just do that? That's a task done. I can check my my notes. Wait, I already did this task. That screen wasn't there before. Wait, what screen? What screen? Um, we got we did this right. We didn't didn't we get the signature? Excuse me. Mail? Did I get new mail? I did not get new mail. 
Innovator Studios. I can't even do that. I already did my my thing. Okay, I need to buy a th something from the vending machine. What the hell is this? Oh, this is the screen he was talking about. If you're reading this, it means that you'll never see me again. It's Parlov. I was hoping to discuss in person, but it seems my time is abruptly was a, has been abruptly cut short. In your possession is a device that now belongs to you. While it may look like a mere pen, it can connect wirelessly to a multitude of devices and hack their security measures. From the information I know, this will be certainly helpful in the near future. You can learn of its hacking capabilities with this screen that I managed to pry off the walls from the of the observer surveillance room. Searching through the executive communications log should hopefully provide some useful information. Be mindful. They will discover every loose end, and you will have no choice but to run. Closing this message will open up the hacking software immediately. What the fuck? Waiting for bypass. Uh... Uh, this one? Plus... Oh, I need to combine them? Oh my god. This one. Then we do... Oh god. I hate this one. And then... This one. Let's go. Oh my god, I have to do it again? Observationutility.exe. Uh, start with... We just need to get the ones in the place we need them. And then turn off this one. Uh, add ones. There we go. Or zeros. God damn it. How many times do I gotta do this? Is this endless? E3 by... Oh, there we go. I got an achievement called Lightning Brain. Complete the puzzles in under 60 seconds. Easy peasy. <laughs> Three unread communication logs. Please note that communication logs are removed 24 hours after the most recent message. I'm a brainiac. This terminal does not have chat privileges. Remaining read only. Okay. Suspected anomaly. Garab. Oh, wait. They're looking after us. Suspected anomaly. Theo M. Blue. 10.15 a.m. Observer. Employee 18044 is showing minor signs of anomalous behavior. Establishing enhanced surveillance protocols on the subject. M. Devons. Is that the one that was recently 44 What does that mean? Employee records show, state, that Theo M. Blue has previously undergone Protocol 44. Mr. Blake has specifically called for level 4 investigation into the suspect. All executives are to be informed immediately, including an activation of full executive security me measures. Suspected anomaly, Gary K. Parlov. Employee 09934 is showing critical signs of anomalous behavior. Advising immediate apprehension protocols on the sus subject. E. Davids. My team is on their way to handle the anomaly. Report will be issued afterwards. The team encountered a physical altercation with the subject. Has barricaded... Wait, who has barricaded themselves within their office space? Excessive use of force is authorized for capture. Observer. I have initiated combative procedure with what I can access. The subject has blocked off the camera in the office, impairing my surveillance of the situation. E. Davids. Anomaly has been captured. Gary K. Parlov was discovered to be inciting rebellion within the company. Subject is to be Protocol 44. The team has begun investigating into identifying possible cooperation. Interesting. Um, anomaly report Lee O. Stanton. Leo Stanton, L. Blake, I need a, I need an update now on the missing anomaly. E. Dark, our search teams are tracking Mr. Stanton as of right now. Uh, our best guess is that they are hiding within the gallery as the tracker frequency is being jammed. I don't want, I don't want guesses. I want results. I expect a debrief by the end of the day. No more excuses. Understood. Yes, sir. We have located and captured the anomaly in the factory distribution center. Center. They are currently being transferred to the Anomaly Assessment Facility. De debrief will be held later today. I expect better competence in the future. Uh, uh-oh. Okay. Uh, they're onto me. They're gonna kill me. I should really turn this off. The camera's literally looking at me! It was looking at me, looking at the thing. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, fuck me. Can I- can I tape over the camera? Stop looking at me like that! <laughs> uh-oh. Uh-oh, I'm gonna be in trouble. Uh, oh, the cameras are following me. Stop observing me. The observer is always watching. Oh, no. 
All right, we need to talk to people, right? Is that the only thing we have left? Oh, we've already talked to people. Oh, yeah, we got the signature. Okay, we need to buy a refreshment. That's the last thing. All right, I'm running. I can't even run. Uh, Liam C. Erickson. Alex D. Stevens. Where's the... Uh, what the fuck? Um. What? What just happened? Hello? Stop looking at me! <laughs> Both toilets are the exact same. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, the... Vending machine? Here we go. Out of order? What do you mean? I feel my eyes going square from staring at the screen. Not a thing. This one? Can I get the... Here we go. Orange soda. It's not orange, though. Look, look, look. Am I gonna be killed here? Hey, hey, Psycho, what's up? Dude, nice throw. Alright, we've done all our all our work. Ah, nice and refreshing. That's a task done. And check my notes on the PC. I already did them all. Can't talk right now. Everything on my to-do list is done. Just in time for my meeting at 1 p.m. Can take the elevator up to the conference room. How the fuck has this possibly reached this high when it's only going up by 10? It's only today. This this thing is a this is a bogus counter. Maybe maybe one of the executives took a break at one point and they get paid like a million a million a minute, so <laughs> that cost a million alone. I don't know. Anyway. Hi. Um, I guess I'm joining you guys in the elevator. Who's talking? It's fucking creepy. <laughs> I don't want to be here. <laughs> this is the awkward situation where everyone is just staring. Everyone is ignoring each other. Everyone's pretending that it isn't a really weird situation to be in. Hi. All right, I'm out. Goodbye. See you around. Executives don't have time to waste on talking to you. Only speak when spoken to. Can I go in here? All right, I guess I go down this. One bad egg spoils the other 11. I can't stop thinking about that tone. Conference room. I was in conference room 44 or something. Was it really just in my head? Or was it 31? Oh, it was floor 31. Conference room... If it was real, how would the executives react? Here we go. Hi. Presents to the executives. Um, don't look at me like that. <laughs> what the fuck? I'll do my presentation. This is the most stressful PowerPoint presentation of my life. You may begin, employee 18044. Introducing the newest tone concept. Good morning to you all. I'm Theo Blue, a senior innovator for the company. I strive to create the most vibrant tones that the world has ever seen. Today, I will be showcasing the new next set of tones that will be released for the upcoming quarter. It's actually interesting. Noted. Left click to change slide. What if I just stay on this slide forever? <laughs> what if I just waste all of these very important executives' time? Huh? Are they gonna do anything? Are you just gonna stare at me forever? Checkmate, motherfuckers! Alright, I'll start. Oh. From the previous quarter, we can see that our recent tones have been extremely successful. Lush gray, midterm silver, under bleached white. From thorough research, we believe to have designed a brand new tones for this upcoming quarter, which will see sales double. One seven. 
Won seven awards at the International Tone Festival. Sold out within 48 hours of initial release. Alright. Inch light. Introducing the newest tone. The burning question we must ask ourselves is how can we improve? I now present to you. Interesting, interesting. Off. Reinforced black. The brand new tone. Um. Hello. Um. Uh, what the fuck is going on? Uh, my PowerPoint presentation is broken. I'm sorry. I showed you color. Theo and Blue, return to your office and stay there. Do not interact with anyone. Um. I apologize. What the fuck? Uh. Run! Holy shit, that's actually terrifying. What the fuck? Um, I will go. I will go. Oh god, everyone's staring at me. Uh, I feel like I won't be living any longer. Uh oh. Everyone knows. I showed them color. Their eyes are big. They're like, what the fuck? That isn't black, white, or gray. Uh, I'm going to just take the elevator. Oh god. <laughs> There's so many damn executives. That's a screenshot right there. What the fuck? <laughs> oh god. No. Um. Alright. <laughs> fuck me, dude. At least they're not staring with big eyes. These guys just seem chill. Everything. Oh god. Um. Uh oh. <laughs> I shouldn't have said anything. I'm going to leave. Goodbye. Goodbye. Run! <laughs> they know. Run! This game is crazy. <laughs> what the fuck? Uninvited guest was also really unique, so it, but this game is unique in an entirely different way. That's very cool to see. Okay, um, I'm probably gonna be. Is there anything new with me? Am I gonna be. Okay, wait. No? Nothing has changed with me. Apparently, I'm still fine. Copy paper, matte finish. Uh, this computer has been disabled until further notice. Please con contact your supervisor. Uh oh. This stress is making me thirsty. Uh, we're gonna be killed. I need another drink. This game is absolutely terrifying. It's the truest... It's the truest terror. An office building. Um... I'm going to get some drinks. I'm friend. I just... I showed you something cool you haven't seen before. What's gonna happen? The water might... The, it's gonna be orange! Oh. Apprehend T Theo M. Blue immediately! Guaranteed promotion as reward! Uh oh! Oh no. Hold shift to sprint! What the fuck?! Oh my god! Help! I'm crazy! Holy shit! <laughs> Did you see how they let how they launched at me? What the fuck? <laughs> Excuse me. Uh-oh. Oh. Retry. Retry me. I got protocol 44 achievement. What the fuck? Wait, I need to see that again. I need to see the fucking jump. Mine, 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 mine. I'm I'm gonna die again. I need to see the jump. <laughs> What the fuck? Look at this. They're coming! Oh lord, they're coming! Ah! <laughs> alright, alright, sorry. I just have to see it one more time. Oh, what the- <laughs> What the hell was happening? They kept jumping? <laughs> alright, anyway, retry me. <laughs> what the fuck? This is terrifying. <laughs> I would do this too for the for the promotion. All right, run, run, run. <laughs> Go. Uh oh, here they come. 
The slow motion. Run! <laughs> Nothing is telling me this isn't gonna be too easy. Turn yourself in immediately. Uh oh. This will close in three seconds. They're not gonna get me. Oh god, they're right there! Go, 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 Jesus! <laughs> this won't end well. Theo, stop and turn around. What the fuck? They're going. Wait, huh? Oh! I see that you can trip over them. Okay, I need to dodge the people that are laying on the floor. All right, all right. noted, noted. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, I see. <laughs> and they're just fucking, they're like hazards. This is crazy. This is exactly why I wanted to play this, just because it's so fucking wild. Okay. The animations are too funny. What the fuck? Run! Alright, don't fall this time. No tripping over other people. They're so damn fast, I can hear them right behind me. I mean, they're the, I, would, I would do this too. If a promotion was on the line. They're turning, turning us against each other. Okay, dodge. You're not gonna get me. Oh boy. Go, go, go. You can't escape. We can draw oh God! Woo! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh no, I got stuck. Holy shit. I'm hiding? How did I do that so fast? I'm insane. I don't think this is gonna stop them. Okay, we'll have a little bit of time, but I still gotta run. I don't have much time. There's nowhere to go, Theo. This elevator is out of order. I need to get out of here. It'll be much easier for the both of us if you let them inside. I'm hacking. I'm hacking the mainframe. Take the elevator. Oh God, encrypted key. Uh, one, one, one. Oh God, I fucked it up. No, Uh, I need a one. Just. Do you reset everything? I need a one somehow there. Oh, this one? And then I need to reset this, this. Holy shit, that was a hard one. Okay. Uh, one's over here, one's over there, one over here. All zeros? Excuse me? I don't need to do anything. Just fucking hit the same one twice. Wait, what? Excuse me? This one. There. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Go, go, go. They're gonna break through. Uh, good afternoon, employee. Blah, 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 blah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. What the fuck? Where did he come from? <laughs> Excuse me? What do you mean? <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? One guy broke through the vents, you piece of shit? Oh, come on. Don't make me try. <laughs> Wait, please tell me I can start from that office. Okay. Wait, I think I can. Yes, here we go. Okay. Wait, I'll have to do the hack again. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, here we go. Oh, boy. They really want this fucking promotion, huh? Uh, all threes. And then just this. I can skip? Skip? Oh, you can skip because I've already done it? I see. Okay. Uh-huh. Um. Oh, God! Press Q or E to dodge? What the fuck? <laughs> what is going on, dude? <laughs> Excuse me? What the fuck? <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> what the fuck? This is actually so hard. What the fuck? <laughs> all of a sudden, it's a combat tutorial. Okay, here we go. Skip the hack. Okay. Skip, 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 skip. I've already done this. Skip. Okay. I gotta press Q or E. There's nowhere to go. They're breaking through there. How do I even do this? I gotta like juke. Oh, I see. I gotta bait them to fall out of bounds. Gotta be more. No, he came in through the window. Okay, go stand at the windows. <laughs> he came in right behind me. <laughs> okay. But do I have to? Maybe if I just dodge them in general, they'll fall to the ground. <laughs> God, I got an achievement called back, I say. Make both suits fall out of the windows? Wait, I did it? But I didn't. I did it, but I didn't at the same time. Okay. 
Hey, uh, skip it. I don't want to do this. Okay, so we need to get them to fall out the windows. Okay. Here they come. Get ready to be juked. Get ready to be juked. No! Woo! Is he gonna stand up again? Oh, yes. Holy shit. They're crazy! I can take the elevator, but I got it. No! I friends the juke button! You peas! <laughs> this is so fucking hard, man. <laughs> God damn it. Fuck you. <laughs> Game is not messing around. <laughs> All right, I got this. I could just leave through the elevator, but I kind of want to get rid of them first. Okay, I need to hack. Go, go, go. Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna first let him jump through and then I think I'm gonna wait over at that window. Okay, here, wait over, over here. And then, whoa! Why didn't you fall out the window? Hey! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Why isn't he falling out the window? Excuse me. What? The other guy is already fucking up again? You... Why didn't he fly out the window that time? I fucking juked him right at the window. Excuse me? <laughs> I don't understand why he didn't fly out. What? It's not broken? He literally fucking swan dived through the window, breaking it. What do you mean it's not broken? <laughs> He fucking headbutted the window. I don't understand. What do you mean? All right, here we go. Look at he breaks the window. He goes fucking there. See, it's broken. And then, ha! Okay, I juked him. He's out the window. Okay, good. Now he's going to break through. And then I got to get the exact same thing. Here. There we go. Bye bye, idiots. Okay, I guess I jump on the elevator. <laughs> we did it, finally. Uh oh. Oh boy. Time to die. Never mind, I'm alive. I feel like people are gonna jump after me. Connection has been lost. The signal may be jammed or disrupted. ODSS will not work until a connection has been re established. I don't really care about that. Never seen this floor before. Where am I? The gallery. Explore the gallery. The latest logo strikes a balance between its nostalgic beginnings and the recent success of the company. The company has expanded to an international level and looked to create a new sleek logo for the company. This began the start of Blake and Whitley innovation. Black and white innovations. A new look for a new era. The third iteration of the logo was intended to be prominent and recognizable. The ever-growing team settled on black and white. BMW. After Leonardo joined the team, it was decided to form a new name. The aim was to portray the newly formed partnership between friends. The duo settled on Blake and Whitley Tone Company. Whitley Tones. The company started out under Whitley Tones, a small business. Oh, I, I have to read it from this. I see. Ran from a garage containing a singular staff member, Jacob Whitley. Innocence of first words. Tone collection. Modern excellence, modern perfection. It's just black and white. Flash of seasons. What do you mean? Slanted corridors and narrowed hallways. <laughs> just like the, the emperor's clothes situation. Bold black design, symbol of unity, employee endorsed, 4.7 grade fabric, custom fit. Refined white pattern, symbol of respect, exclusive to executives, 9.6 grade fabric, comfortable fit, suit for a king. Observer camera version, observer camera, full tone printer, ice cold vending machine, modern cooler, modern water cooler. What the fuck? Wait, this is the mega pack. Blake and Whitley office accessory mega pack. This is what I got when I started working here. Uh, what do we got over here? Jacob Whitley, a natural born artist and innovator. 
From a young age, Jacob Lidley showed a keen interest in art and spent much of his free time drawing and painting using his exceptional talent for tone mixing and shading. He was able to create paintings featuring vibrant tones unlike anything the world has ever seen. During his search for success, Jacob started selling the unique tones he created. Artists from around the globe praised his one-of-a-kind tones. Soon enough, the success of a small garage-run business became too big for one person to handle. Jacob Woodley called an old university friend, Leonardo Blake, a business-centric person who was looking for an exit from his lucrative insurance company. Blake took the partnership offer with a heartbeat. Within a heartbeat, form forming a power duo set to take the world by storm. Together they went from strength to strength, pioneering a new era of tone design and distribution. Despite his success as an entrepreneur, Jacob continues to paint in his, separate, in his spare time. He is grateful for the opportunities that his success has afforded him, but he never forgets his root as a, roots as a painter and remains passionate, passionate to his humble beginnings. <clears throat> I see. What's, what's next? Vibrant, yes indeed. Maintenance panel, authorized use only. What if I use it? Dot. Why is the dot on the eye blinking? What if I press I on my keyboard? I click the dot. What? The hacking device isn't responding. I need to make a color. I'll have to figure this one out myself. I need to find like an hex, a hex code. The symbols at the top must be important. Oh, okay. So we have black and white. We have a computer and we have a suit. The logo. Let's see. Hacker mode activated. <clears throat> this is one, two, three. This is the third one. The third iteration. And we have 4.7 fabric. Maybe. And then we have one, one, seven. Okay, so one, one. Let's see. So the third one for this. And I, I can't set it to different numbers. It's got to be binary, right? Oh, no. Three. And then one, seventeen, zero. And then 4.6, right? 4.7. There we go. I did it. Easy peasy. What did I just do? I'm opening a secret room. What is this area? There's just access here. There's nothing more. All right. Well, I guess we go into the secret room. It's zero. Thank you for the prime. Um. <clears throat> oh. Can't go in here. Can't go in there. Wonder what those doors hold. This feels like horror Stanley Parable. Um, hello, Theo. What the fuck? Many years I have waited. I know who you are. I know who you can be. There is more to this place than black and white. Trust no one but yourself. <laughs> I'm Neo. Running away won't stop this madness. We need to take the color pill. You can stop it for good. Objective? Retrieve the floppy disk containing the presentation. That's it. Do this and I can tell you more. Uh, but how are we going to get into the building again? Good luck, Theo. Well, uh... Is that the end? Are we going to... No! 
This, that's gotta be the end of the first chapter. That's so cool. What the hell? So yeah, the Blink Dream Studios make insane games. I, if you like this, now the game that they made before this is very different, but I absolutely loved it. The game before this was kind of like Welcome to the game, but in a really interesting, it was like a home invasion game with a really interesting style. So if you want to watch their other game that I've played, you can link it or you can, you can click the link over in the top right. Um, this one was amazing. What a unique concept, color, the invention of color where everyone is just crazy. Uh, and this was only chapter one, so there's more chapters coming. This one actually is free, so you can play this for yourself. But there's apparently quite a few achievements. Uh, there's history notes that I didn't see. There is... There's a dog? Wait in your office after getting in trouble. Who's a good boy? Achievement. And there's some other things. Uh, interesting. Anyway, this game was very cool. I can't wait to see the full game come out. Definitely going to play that when it does come out. Let me know what you thought. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you liked the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the lovely gamers over here in chat, you can join us over at twitch.tv slash Click the link in the description down below. Thank you so much. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye.